Hi, Ironic. Hi, Daniel. Hi, Liam. Thank you. <laughs> I love yippee. Yes, it is finally time. Hello. How are you doing, Liam? I love these freaking birds. They look so cute. Ah! Okay. You are alive? Yeah, me too. It's sadly 2 a.m. Oh, jeez. It's my 9 a.m. It is finally time for Navia. I'm just running around. I'm okay. I'm good. I'm tired. I am increasingly... I, maybe not increasingly, but I'm, I'm realizing every day more and more that I am not a morning person. And so <laughs> I'm going to hopefully, um, when my current class is done, be able to go to a different class at a different time at like the afternoon time so that I can, you know. I do wake up at 5 a.m. every day and I hate it. I wake up every day at 5 a.m. and it's awful. I feel so tired every day. And so I'm like, Ugh, no thanks. I'm like, I'd like the 2 p.m. class, please. So that hopefully I'm able to like <laughs> sleep and rest. Also, my mic's been being kind of weird. So if you can't hear me, please let me know. Do you wake up at 5 a.m.? Wait, 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 wait. Are you saying that you're going to wake up at 5 a.m.? today and it's 2 a.m. for you bruh you do yeah me too it's bad I don't like it okay it's Navia time I'm so excited ah! okay I love her so much man oh you don't get sleep man can't relate I have to get sleep oh, if it isn't my partner, <gasps> there she is that voice. It's Navia. I love her the drip oh my god <laughs> i didn't expect to run into you guys here today are you headed somewhere say no plans in particular my queen well, you, Navia. are you still busy rebuilding plus one couldn't uh, say that if i tried up most of the rebuilding but there are still a few things left to take care of i'm glad you got her too liam maybe one day i just have to secure risley as soon as I secure Risley, everybody else is up for grabs. Like, I'm going for whoever I want after that. Stocking up on materials, confirming construction timelines, discussing compensation terms with families affected by the disaster. Uh, uh, between all of that, I've been making a lot of trips between the court and Poisson. Hello, Ironic, hello. Wait, wasn't Spinda? Uh... Yeah, why are they offering compensation? Well, though the victims have received relief payments from the court, in my opinion, as the administrators of Poisson, Spina de Rosula should take some wow. responsibility as well. She's so responsible Our and nice. The situation right now isn't the best, so all we've been doing is signing agreements for the damages to be repaid at a later date. Though just pieces of paper now, they demonstrate our commitment. They're necessary to restore the people's faith in us. Oh, spoken like a true president. You're yeah. You're a really responsible leader. That must be taking up most of your time, though, right? Oh, you bet. Between that and all the other errands I have to run at the court, I'm always forgetting one thing or another. Ironic, next time. It'll be good. So before I came over this time, I took a page from Elusa's book and decided to make a list of everything. This way, it's easy to see which tasks you haven't checked off. That's actually pretty smart. And then, since Malus loved using shorthand, I decided to also follow his example and come up with some shorthand of my own. But after running a few errands in the city, I'm kind of struggling to even read my own handwriting anymore. Oh my god, <laughs> that happened to me. I, like, made a bunch of my own, like, shorthand things for, um like notes to myself like people like ppl and like um like teacher t students ss like workbook wb like some of them seem obvious but i looked back at some of my notes and it was like all just shorthand and i was like ah, i don't know what any of this says oh no ah it's just uh 
it was a time it was hard 4.7 phase 2 maybe i'll be ready i have 190 wishes ready to go and i'm not stopping until he's here i'm gonna do all the story quests i'm doing the teapot yes ironic i plan to have quite a few more farming streams because i want risley so <laughs> there will be many more that does sound like you all right so what kind of shorthand did you use yeah i'm curious oh, want to take a look yes let's play one and see uh, wait there's nothing here but a bunch of weird symbols this looks like a a piece of kelp wrapped <laughs> in a stick and this other one He's so cute. Did she just draw pictures? Oh my god. <laughs> Liam, don't jinx me. <laughs> oh, I've been through that. I feel like, I can't remember who it was, but there, I think it was Wanderer. That happened to me with Wanderer the first time. And so the second time when I actually got him, I was so excited. Ugh. I want to see her short hand. I don't want to hear Paimon talk about it. I want to see it. Let me see it. one has to do with confirming the final payment amount for the fishermen well the look at our faces it's a reminder to try the new burger that just hit the market okay but <laughs> I can definitely see how you might forget what each of these mean yeah maybe just use I like that maybe just use standardized shorthand symbols next time don't use symbols use like abbreviations like use text but like abbreviate the text like teacher is a capital T you know whiteboard is like WBD like you know like pictures I couldn't even imagine trying to do that with pictures just write out each item next time no I feel like standardized shorthands better <laughs> thank you for your advice these are the kinds of things you only really figure out once you've tried them out yourself I thought that as long as I understood my shorthand when I came up with it, I'd be sure to remember the symbols when I looked at them later. Unfortunately, I've definitely proven myself wrong. Well, now you know for next time. <laughs> Thank you, Ironic. Also, good night, anyway, Liam. Rest I well. I've already taken care of most of the things on the list. There are still a few symbols that I can't decipher, but I don't think they're anything too super important. Thank you so much. You have an amazing rest. Worst comes to worst, I'll just make another trip. That's a lot of time, though, girl. Yep, that's the plan. Oh, actually, since we talked about the reconstruction earlier, want to come with me and check out the town for yourself? You yeah. You don't have any plans, right? So we can just catch a boat and head over. It won't take long at all. Good, love it. Uh, it's a bit sudden, but Paimon doesn't see why not. What do you think, Traveler? I'm not going to say pretty nice break. We're going to say I'd be interested in taking a look. Then let's go. We'll take a boat over. This is oh, legitimately... Hold on. The Aquabus, right? Like the Clementine one? Oh, Clementine. This is one of like the only character hangouts for a five star that I've been excited for. I can't even remember the last time I was excited for one of these. So I'm like, yeah, let's go Navia. Oh, sorry. I meant our own boat. The Aquabus doesn't have a station near Poisson, so oh, okay, we'll okay. use one of the Spina's boats. I was like, why is this yellow? And it's like, oh, it's telling me that like, if I hit it, we're definitely starting. And if I press this one, we're not starting, you know? You have a school? Oh, I, I don't know why. I read it a school trip and I was like, where are you going? And it's like, oh, no, it's just, it's just normal school. Oh, it is a field trip. Okay, okay. My eyes did not deceive me. I hope that you have an amazing field trip. Love field trips. It's 8 p.m. No worries. No worries. Thank you for stopping by. And I hope that you have fun. I Field trips are the best. All right, follow me. I'll take you there. Yeah, Navia, let's go, girl. Sleep is important, especially when you got a school trip. You want to have all the energy for that. Because they probably, I don't know, I feel like on school trips they make everybody walk. Like, ten times more than is necessary. Mm, the engineer is still doing a few routine safety checks. We can head out as soon as we get the green light. So, Paimon has always wanted to ask. The three aquabus lines are all 
named after people in your family, right? That is so cool. I love the orchestra. I used to be in an orchestra like a very long time ago. I play the clarinet or played. I haven't played it since I was in the orchestra. <laughs> but that's fun. I hope you have a good time. Yeah, that's right. Callus and Nadia are self-explanatory. Oh. Well, Clementine was the name that my mother went by. That's so cool. I didn't know that. If you provided the Mora to build the lines, then why isn't there even a dedicated line to Poisson? Yeah. Paimon asking the good questions. Built all the lines, yet you still have to take a special boat just to go home. Paimon doesn't get it. I don't get it either. Well, what I heard is that most of our businesses don't actually use Poisson as a hub. So there was no real reason to build a line straight to Poisson. You are right that it is a bit strange, though. If you've already committed to build three lines, why not just add a fourth? Yeah. Yeah, what the heck? Okay, cool. And also, thank you. Thank you, Ironic. Why not add a fourth? What the heck? The Aquabus is so convenient. It's really a huge shame. Well, it is what it is. You know what my father was like. Even I often struggled to figure out what was going on in his head. Yeah. I feel like perhaps the rest of Spina didn't see a point of having a fourth line. I feel like this one's more what I would say. Well, something that big also wouldn't have been just his call. Like, you know. <laughs> but that would only be the case if he cared <laughs> about what others thought. My father was always really <clears throat> stubborn. Once he made up his mind, good luck getting him to change it. <clears throat> From what I've heard, the rights of all the other members of the Spina only went as far as giving him advice or suggestions. Oh, jeez. And no farther. That included my mother, too. Huh. Well, that explains why you weren't on the greatest of terms with him. Yeah. Because I wouldn't just let him keep getting his way. He was just... <sighs> not very agreeable. Boss, the boat's ready. Oh, we nice. Can all right, then let's head out. Let's go! Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I'm very interested in what her story is about. Braving the tides together. Act one. It'll Those be a while ducks. before we get to Poisson. Let's keep talking. Hmm, Nadia, what was your mother like as a person? I'm on, that's a big question. I love that. Oh, Ether's like, sorry. what the heck? We totally forgot that you mentioned before that she passed away during childbirth, so you probably don't remember her at all. I love Ether's face. He was like, what are you doing? Uh, that's all right. I've heard many stories about her from the rest of the Spina. They've always said that they were sure we would have gotten along famously. While my papa was stiff like a board, my mother was supposedly super cheerful and funny. Their complementary personalities allowed them to make up for each other's flaws. Yeah, I feel like it's true that in a sense that like opposites attract. My father would run the businesses and expand our reach, while my mother would keep the peace and make sure that everyone was happy. Their work made sure that the Spina could grow and thrive. Sounds like they were not just a well-matched couple, but fantastic business partners as well. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, but those are just stories and anecdotes after all. It's hard for me to piece together a more complete or intimate picture of her. But sometimes, I'd still look at the Clementine line and wonder, would the Spina and Poisson still be what they are today had my mother survived? Silver once said that a name is a kind of inscription, a way to etch a memory into the world. When given a name, a cold, inanimate object can gain a completely new meaning. I feel so bad for Navia. I feel like Hoyo was just like the line with her in my heart. They were like, oh, Navia? Over the past Tragic. Weeks, I've also begun to appreciate how water can take in and hold our most intense feelings and memories, as well as how one may reflect on their past by watching the sea. I've lost many beloved people and memories to the sea. Even though I cannot stop for them, and must continue to keep moving. The fact won't change that they existed in my life and gave me the reason and motivation to move forward. Or just say, do you miss them? I feel like we don't need to bring up Malus and Silver right now after she Always. just talked about her mom. But no matter what, we can't change the past. But 
I tell myself that I need to keep looking towards the future. Everyone, even my parents, have already overcome so many obstacles. Thank you so much. I hope that you have a good night. Sleep well. Enjoy your field trip. And thank you. I've got to keep my chin up. Okay, there we go. My like controller was not working. What is going on? Intense water sounds. Huh, we've reached the shore. Let's go. I'll show you the new Poisson. Poisson. Navia. Do you think she's doing all right? Absolutely not. <laughs> I don't think at all. She seems to be managing. She's always been having to cope with one thing or another. Yeah. Okay. Pylon supposes you're right. She's really been through a lot. It couldn't have been easy shouldering so much by herself. Yeah, I feel bad for her. Oh, okay. I just want to see. Just curious. I knew it! Okay. Wait. But I want to finish this story, but no. Okay, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I just want to- I just want to mark it. I'm just gonna mark it on my map. Oh my god, stop. And there's another thing, too. We're just taking a quick detour. You know, got my priorities straight. Do I gotta fight? Is that- is that a thing for fighting? Yes, it is. Okay. What even is that? Oh, he's gonna stand up and then he's real big. I didn't recognize him sitting down. Okay, let's get it. Oh, I love that he has a scythe. Oh my god, I want a scythe. A touch of frost. Chicha, let's go. Hey. Nice. Hey. Empty chest. Go back Good to Navia temporarily. Just wait. Oh, no, we're going the wrong way. No, I thought this was going <laughs> to No! Where is it taking me? I thought it was taking me to the What's it called? The thing for the Statue of the Seven. Instead, it's taking me I don't know where. But I'm not happy about it. What the heck? Hello, little babies. I don't know why I'm here. Okay, that was not what I wanted. Okay, let's go back. Okay, we'll go up here. <gasps> ah! Okay. I get lost super easy. Okay, okay, okay. I see it. I see it. Oh, but I need to make sure I don't accidentally... Activate it because I really, 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 really want to get the, I think, Hydroculus? Hydroculus, that's what it's called. I want to get the Hydroculus. Oh my god, I thought he spotted me. And I was like, no. The music is so good. I love the music in Genshin. I don't know why, but like, Fontaine really gives me Studio Ghibli vibes. Very like, in my opinion, like, for house moving castle, if you will. Very good. Okay, let's try and find this again. It's supposed to be. Oh, sick. We love that. Oh no, wait. We don't love that. It's right next to one of these things. Oh my god. I'm risking it all for this. I'm risking my literal life. Okay, where are we going? Why is it pointing underground? I don't want to be underground. Okay. I love that you can like kind of see through the water, but it doesn't look nearly as beautiful as it does when you're actually there. Okay, let's get ourselves back over to where we respond, and then start from there. Are we supposed to go down? I guess we're going down. I guess we're literally falling. Okay, we're running, we're running. Hey. Okay, so we are going underground, but like not under the water. Not under the sea, if you will. This is such a cool freaking place. I love this place. It looks so good. This is giving me like Dark Cloud 2. 
If you know, you know. Where are we going? Okay, there we go. We're close. Oh, nice. Okay. Good landing. Her heels are so high. Oh, you're back! Traveler in Paimon! Welcome back to Poisson! Oh, hey! Fancy seeing you again, Florent! Is it your turn to take care of Navia now? Not Paimon having, like, almost perfect pronunciation. <laughs> hey, I can totally take care of myself. For the time being, I'll go around without any attendance. We did hand over some of Malus's old responsibilities to Florent, though. It's been really nice to have him around to help out. Good. Thank you for the compliment, boss. Yeah. As you see, I've been working closely with the boss on rebuilding Poisson. Poisson. Mr. Malus was an extremely capable and respected member of the Spina. I've got some really big shoes to fill. All right, all right. There's no need to be so formal. Everyone's practically old friends by now. Were you waiting here for me? Did we manage to make any progress on the statue? Yeah, we contacted a sculptor about the job, but they can't get started on sourcing a correctly sized block without knowing the design that we want to use first. That makes sense. You're commissioning a statue? Yeah, of who? Uh, so, basically, we've been meaning to commission a statue of my parents in commemoration of everything they've done for the Spina and the town of Poisson. Oh, that's nice. But since my father was known as Callus the Unfaithful for the longest time, oh, yeah. it would have been too controversial to commission a statue of him. Yeah, that would have been now bad. Now his name has been cleared, and the town is also being rebuilt, I thought this would be the perfect chance to actually realize this dream. I agree, that's the nice. The funds to build the statue were freely donated by the people of Poisson to show their appreciation for Miss Clementine and Mr. Callus and everything they did. Yeah, shouldn't Navia be in the... Statue too? What the heck? Me? I'm just the newbie president that's running around and causing everyone trouble. No, you've done a lot. <laughs> Maybe we can have this conversation again in a few decades. Once I've done more for the town and the people. She's so humble, hey, girl. Stop. So humble. Yeah. You just helped save the entire country. Yeah, I was like, did we forget about that? Because uh, I didn't forget. I agree wholeheartedly. I also believe that Boss should have a place on the statue. Yeah. Hey, if you keep inflating my ego like this, I might just float off into the sky with my parasol. Oh my god. <laughs> just kidding. There's no way that I'd accept that kind of compliment at face value. At a minimum, I'd have to match what my father did for the people. I think it'll be just a matter of time. <laughs> Thanks for the vote of confidence. I just don't think I'm ready yet. Anyway, Florent, now it's up to us to confirm the final design, right? Mm-hmm. We can ask the sculptor to start looking for a good block once we've decided on the poses for Miss Clementine and Mr. Callus. But we haven't had any real discussions yet on the possible designs. I feel like I should get a few promising designs first and then send them over to you to review. Uh, there's no need for all that. Let's decide on a design right now. Ooh, hey, I love that. You. Come over here with me. No. Hey, you. I don't get a name. Hey, you. Take three steps to the left with me. Modeling a few <laughs> poses, of course. Oh my gosh, okay. Here, just pretend to be callous, and I'll be Clementine. That's... Um, okay. Didn't you say on the boat that callous and Clementine sounded like great partners? Well, then there's no one better to fill this role than my most valuable partner. I love that, yes. Laura, get over there. Some reference shots. You've got it, boss. I'll go get the camera. Well, what do you think? Got any ideas? <laughs> uh, shouldn't you be running this show? Well, I've actually discussed it a bit with Florent before. <clears throat> but I could never come up with any fresh or original ideas. It's probably because my idea of them is already kind of set in stone. So, I want to pick your brain for a bit and see if you can come up with some new and interesting ideas. Yeah, you get up on top of my shoulders and then we'll spin around. I'm all good here, <laughs> boss. Feel free to start posing whenever. Oh, we have to really think? Okay, then let's try for something imposing. Okay, then let's try looking out into the distance. Then why don't we just strike a happy pose? Um... I feel like happy pose would be kind of unsettling. Mm, I think look out into huh. the distance. By that, do you mean as if 
we were standing on a boat and looking out at the sea? Yes. Sure. Let's give that a try. Aw, cute. Oh, you really remind Paimon of a captain and their first mate. Love it. Look over there, my dear <laughs> Clementine. As you can see, every tree on that island is dripping with Mora fruit. Good voice. Mm, but there's something off with the composition. This pose makes Mr. Callus look too tall next to the lady. What? Oh, I see what you mean. Uh, then let's swap. Ha, I love that. It's so oh, cute. A statue like this would look fantastic on a boat. Wait, but uh, we can't do that. Very few people would see the statue if we were to put it on a boat. This is literally this so is cute. To be placed in the town. But oh. Then, since we're putting it in the town, the whole point of the pose would be lost. Oh, okay. We'll try to think of something else. Let's do. We're just doing a brainstorming session. Imposing. Huh? Love it. Oh, I've got it. Let's try this. Ooh! Oh my God, she's so cute. <gasps> Look at them. Wait, I have to be obnoxious. I want. Okay, wait. Okay, good. This pose. <laughs> I love that. It makes Take me my own picture. Glorious golden age. But isn't Clementine's pose a bit too bold and heroic? Was she really that kind of person? If we were to stick with this pose, maybe people would wonder if she was actually the real boss behind it. Oh my god, we're thinking too deep. Well, tabloids did indeed speculate as much back in the day. But the speed oh my god. the strings and made both the report and the journalist uh, disappear. That's terrifying. Oh, Paimon was just kidding. Please don't make Paimon disappear. Yeah, a lot of people don't like Paimon, but Paimon's like one of my favorites. I love her. <laughs> what Florent meant was that we asked the journalist to choose a new alias. You're right, though, that this may not accurately represent the image of her in our hearts. Let's try to come up with something else. Happy pose. Let's a get it. Happy pose. You mean something like we were laughing together at a funny joke? I think that'd be a lot nicer. Oh my god. <laughs> That's too cute. Uh, would all that be able to come through with just a picture? Would we even be able to tell what they are supposed to be laughing about? I thought happy was just smiling. Yeah. And that'd probably be a massive pain to sculpt as well. Hmm. Can one of you try striking a pose like you're talking while the other one laughs? my god. I don't think that's it, but it's cute. That actually sounds pretty hard to pull off. Forget it. Let's try something else. I got it. Just smile at the camera. Oh, cute. Oh, no, no, no. Cute, but no. Uh, <laughs> I love this. Oh my god. Oh, I feel that. Oh, don't worry. We still got a lot of reference shots out of the session, and each of them can be considered to be a souvenir in their own right. Let's just keep the ideas we tried as backups. Man, if I knew I was going to do a photo shoot with the traveler, I would have prepared a lot of outfits and props ahead of time. <laughs> that is so cute. Oh, so precious. Outfits. Oh, that's the errand I forgot back in the city. Do either of you still remember that girl? The girl I went to see with you two. Her name is Adele. Rolling in the deep. Oh, Paimon remembers her. She was the one that we met while investigating Mr. Callus's case, right? Yes, that's exactly who I'm talking about. So, after the case, she was finally willing to talk to me. And she told me that she wanted to join the Spina, too. I said that it's fine, but young children are not allowed to join the Spina. She will just have to wait a few years, and then we'll welcome her with open arms. Since she's still a child, though, she thought I was just trying to let her down gently. Aww. But how could I get her to believe that I meant what I said? In the end, I came up with an idea. I'd have a Spina uniform made and give it to her as a gift. But I got so busy and distracted in the city that I forgot to pick the uniform up. Literally so I me. did forget something important after all. Like, I gotta make a list and, like, set multiple alarms on my phone if I'm going to have any chance of remembering anything. Don't worry, boss. 
I can send someone to pick it up right away. Good, 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 good. Matter of the statue, we should still come up with a few more ideas for the design. I'll have to trouble you to source some for me. We could have just done that from the start. Hey, at least this way we got some cool pictures. Yeah, Paimon, be positive. Uh, yeah, you're right. They'll have some value as souvenirs at least. Yeah. Cute. <laughs> Navia, Laurent, guess who's back? I love that he has the same hair as the people from like Inazuma and Liwei. <laughs> oh my god, but he's in a suit. Love oh, that. Well, if it isn't Coulter. Back already from the Fortress of Meripede? What? <laughs> I don't right. remember him. I finally finished serving my time. Gotta say, it turns out I was a lot tougher than I thought. After I got out, I immediately made a beeline back to Poisson. You'd say that familiar briny smell became a primal call, urging me to forget everything else and just come back home. You wouldn't believe how much I've missed Melissa's grilled fish. Aww. I dreamed about it every time I had to get a welfare meal down there underneath the sea. It's good to have you back, Coulter. You look as well as ever. And this guy is? Yeah, I'm with Paimon. Ah, Am I supposed to know who this you. is? This is Coulter. Another of Spina di Rosula's members. He was found guilty and sentenced to the Fortress of Meripede some time ago. What'd he do? But, looking at it now, it was probably oh no. another one of Marcel's plots while he worked at the Confrerie of Cabriere. That's so messed wait, up. Wait, Mr. Marcel? What do you mean? He was involved in some <gasps> sort of plot? He doesn't even know? Have you heard anything at all about the water from the Primordial Sea case? Well, I know that Fontaine got flooded, but then the water levels miraculously <gasps> receded. He doesn't I even know. Well, there was to it, and didn't care to ask for any more details. You mean Mr. Marcel was somehow involved with all that? I mean, nobody uh, looks like we'll knows have to what's going on from the top. That case, uh, a lot of things have happened in Poisson since then. What's on? First things first. Let me introduce you Love to it. these two. They're my most trusted partners. And they've been with me through thick and thin. Now you could call them Spina di Rosula's VIP helpers. I'm on so cute. Oh, nice to meet you. I don't recall Navia ever generously complimenting anyone like that before. So you must be pretty amazing to get that from her. <laughs> yeah, we are indeed pretty amazing. But we've been cool since before we even met her. All credit to Paimon. Wait, now you suddenly resist taking a dig at Paimon? <laughs> Nice, nice. Spina di Rosula always seems to attract great people. Oh, that reminds me. Oh no! <gasps> oh Are no! Always by your side. Um. Ah! About that. Oh my God. Culture. A lot of things happened while you were gone. As you can see, even Poisson isn't quite the same That's as. That's so sad. How it was before you left. They lost their lives, keeping me safe during the flood. What did you say? Oh my god. This isn't some kind of morbid welcome home prank, right? <laughs> no. You're just scaring me on purpose because I don't know anything about what's happened. No. I'm sorry, but it's the truth. They weren't the only people we lost either. Many god. others, including Melissa, also lost their lives in the disaster. Luce. And Melissa, dead. They're just gone. He does. He doesn't care about silver. <laughs> God. Luce, I was planning Aww. a surprise gift once I ran into him again in town. Uh, I can't believe it. I feel bad for him. Uh, hey, keep it together. Come on, he's allowed to have a breakdown. This is actually very shocking and upsetting. Malus and Coulter were friends for many years. And even served on many missions together oh, okay. during the early days of Vespina. I can understand how he feels. Well, let's sit down somewhere, so I can tell you everything that has happened while you were gone. Fair warning, there was a lot. Jeez. I'm... Okay. I feel bad for him. He finally gets his freedom, and he comes back, and like everyone's dead. Like oof. Yeah, big oof, Nash. I feel bad for this guy. 
he finally like gets out of jail comes home and his best friend and whoever melissa is just d dead absolutely heartbreaking Ugh. how you doing nash how where do i go okay we're gonna go this way i don't think it's the way that they wanted me to go but i don't care <laughs> it works for me they will run in i love these your dog is sleeping next to you. Your dog is literally the cutest. What well, little baby? Uh, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. There's a cat? I love cats. What kind of cat? Ooh, okay, here we go. We're on the boat now. Navia explains everything that has happened recently to Coltier. All of this. It's unbelievable. I, I can't believe that those stories were real. It all really happened. Has the world gone mad? Yeah, I, I would also have found them very difficult to accept. <laughs> A tsundere one. I love that. I think you and I both feel the same way about the profound tragedy of Melusa's loss. And the sheer depravity of Marcel's actions. I wish that instead of just like a black screen and it being like she explained what happened I wish that we could have also been told what happened because I don't have a good memory and it's been quite a while since it happened and like a little refresher would have been cool the dog and cat don't usually get along yeah when I was growing up we had a cat and dog and they also didn't get along the dog was very chill and the cat was not chill I thought mr. Marcel would always stand by the Sphina Everything he had, the Spina gave to him. It's unconscionable to have received all that, and yet still plot to kidnap and dissolve you for his insane research. The good news is that the Confrérie of Cabriere is no more. Gone with them too is the entire synth manufacturing and distribution network. <sighs> we finally closed the curtain on that long struggle. Nice. Are you sure? But if Marcel wanted to rebel against us, he probably sent word in secret to Romeo. Oh god, I have no hope of pronouncing these names. Rome who? Yeah, Rome who? Huh. Not a name I've heard before either. Sick, love that well, for I us. Remember him. You see, there was once a major internal dispute regarding funding the construction of the Aquabus lines. Romeu oh. was the leader of the faction that thought such a vast sum of mora would be better spent improving the town of Poisson. Poisson. But Mr. Callus believed that an opportunity to collaborate with the court of Fontaine and the Fontaine Research Institute was hard to come by and would allow us to build many valuable relationships. Not only would the Aquabus be a good business investment, it would also boost our reputation among the general populace, eventually paying us massive dividends down the line. Every time they say poisson, I think of that like croissant meme, and I can't take it seriously. But the it's two bad. couldn't come to an agreement. Romeu ended up taking a lot of people with him when he left Spino di Rosula altogether, and the split was on extremely bad terms. Ugh. And with Papa's stubbornness, I can definitely imagine how it must have gone down. And of course, when he was suffering the slings and arrows of outrageous injustice, those relationships that he spent a fortune to build didn't help in the least geez what the yeah. heck you could say it was the price he paid for sticking to his beliefs i couldn't have been the first time a dispute like this happened right oh that's a good point if Carlos was really as stubborn as you say then wouldn't he have argued with the rank and file all the time oh yeah it eventually became a thing that just happened on every day that ended with why oh my god <laughs> but navia <laughs> uh, i mean boss you might not know this, but he wasn't always like that. I'm gonna start saying that. It just happens in every day that ends with why. That's amazing. He used to be a lot better with taking counsel. With him listening to our advice and Miss Clementine also frequently on our side, it was pretty smooth sailing for a good many years. But on the matter of the Aquabus, even Miss Clementine completely stood by Mr. Callis's side. Oh. Huh. I never knew. From my perspective, Romeo's position had a lot going for it. Couldn't they have sat down and talked it out? I think the Aquabus was just the straw that broke the camel's back. Yeah, sounds like On it. On that topic, they eventually came to a rather radical conclusion. They believed that 
Miss Clementine lost her ability to serve as an impartial mediator when she became pregnant with Callus's child. You mean Navia? <laughs> Why are we talking like that? So, they thought she had betrayed them? But, that doesn't make any sense. Before she was their mediator, my mother was also her own person, and a member of the Spina. She should have the right to take any side she wished. Yeah. Yeah, but to them, even taking a side was betrayal enough. They felt like their voices could no longer be heard once Aww. their sole mediator had gone over to the other side. It's actually really sad. Of course, Ms. Clementine then passed away, and Mr. Callus began to regard the completion of the Aquabus project as her final wish. With that, the last hope of reconciliation was gone. Jeez. So that's what happened. From that point on, Romeu and his people cut ties with the Spina. And never gave us any kind of professional or personal courtesy ever again. Damn. Perhaps they've regarded us as enemies ever since they left. But even so, there is still no proof that they ever acted in concert with Marcel. Uh, Marcel sounds in pretty a crazy. Good financial position, so they've been lying low for a while. But as long as they exist, they'll continue to be a threat. Huh. I think Coulter's got a point. Both Marcel and Romeu had my father in their sights for a very long time. Even though Marcel's faction has been dissolved, we still don't know anything about Romeu's whereabouts. If they're still trying to get revenge on us, with how distracted and vulnerable we are, yeah. now would be the best time. Literally thinking the same thing, like, now's the time, so... Which is probably gonna happen. And that's gonna be what this hangout quest is about. Good thinking, boss. We should keep an eye on them at all times. I'll let my men know right away. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you for that, Laurent. And Coulter, thank you for telling me about this as well. Uh, don't worry. I still feel fine. so bad for him. Do you have a moment right now? How about we go out for a walk? I've heard so many incredulous things today. I'm finding it a bit hard to calm down even now. I mean, to think that I'll just never see them again. Yeah, that's pretty, oh, that's pretty hard. In that case, why don't we go back to the court? I can pick up Adele's uniform while we're there as well. It'll save Laurent's guys a trip. Want to come with me again, you two? You don't mind, do you, Coulter? Oh, uh, uh, of course. That's fine by me. I think he asked you specifically for some time alone, but okay. We can invite other people. Let's go! Paimon feels like a lot hinging on this visit. Yeah, we want to see the future star of the Spina. <laughs> we really are the best of partners. Come on. Let's go. I feel like Navia is best girl. I love her personality. She's so sweet and nice. I just want to see. Really? Wait, okay, wait, wait, wait. I know eyes on the prize, but also Primos. Up here? Or is it like outside of the cave? We're just gonna we're gonna just check like real quick. Razor, you can do it. You can do it. Is it up here? Oh. Oh, it is! Oh my god! Get in there. Get in there, my dude. Okay. Exquisite. Empty chest. Love that. For storage. I also forgot that if you go in here and then you do these things, you get primos. So I'm gonna get a single primo gem. Which I did it yesterday and I got literally like 12. It was amazing. Where? Are they up or down? What is this? Okay, hopefully they're down. Under the ground. Oh, sick. Ugh. Fontaine is so freaking beautiful. Leeway is still my favorite place, though. Always has been, and probably always will. It is just too pretty. Okay, where are they at? Where are we going? What is happening? We're going up? Okay. Alright, no, we gotta wait. I ran too fast. No stamina. I do have to say that the little, uh, I forget what they're called, let me check. I forget. Nope, that is not the menu that I wanted. There we go. What is it called? This thing. These. What are they called? Sealies. Mini Sealy. I still feel like the Fonte Mini Sealy is the prettiest though. Like, this one is, is pretty cute. I like blue. So I'm like, that looks good. And then I got the yellow one because I was like, oh, yellow would look like really good with razor, which it does. But... The Fontaine one is like 
low-key iridescent -y. Like, it looks, like, iridescent, opalescent. Like, it looks good. It's nice to walk from time to time. We're walking? Think of it as something like... I guess he wanted to go for a walk, so... Once we're there, we can stay a few days before we return. Oh, okay. This is like a trip trip. Sounds good. I haven't walked this road in a long time. So if he was guilty, but then the bad guy was found, why wasn't he let out of jail, like, immediately? I do not understand. Also, I saw something running up here, and I'm curious what was running. Also don't want to fight them, so maybe I shouldn't... Oh, yeah, 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 no, 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 no. Why are we running? No! Okay. No, 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 I shouldn't go over there because then I'll be stuck in a fight during the cutscene. This has happened to me one too many times. And then I usually die in the middle of the cutscene. That happened in the Chasm, I believe, and then it also happened in the Inazuma. Go. Okay. Hey, sir. Oh, it's just a fire. I was like, what is that? Okay. Wait, wait, oh, it's over there. I'm like, I'm where I'm supposed to be. Okay. Well, we've walked far enough for now. Let's take a break. Since we're out for a walk, we shouldn't stress too much about the destination. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> I've grown old, so I'm not as fit as before. It's a good thing that at least my work down in the fortress was quite the workout. Well, Paima thinks you're doing great. Yeah. You didn't have to slow down for you at all. Back in the days before the Aquabus lines were built, we often had to hike north with our goods, then catch a boat to the court. Malus and I must have traveled this way hundreds of times. When we were tired, we would lay down for a while on the grass, and when we were hungry, we'd catch a fish or two. Actually sounds like the ideal life. The Spina was still on the rise back then. Mr. Callus was generous, and everyone had the chance to strike it rich. So, of course, we all worked really hard. And now, in the blink of an eye, the Aquabus lines have been built, and this road has fallen into disuse. I don't think that's bad, though. Oh, I know. I was just being a little nostalgic. Understandable, my then dude. let's stay here a bit longer. Anyone want snacks? Hell yeah, I always want oh, snacks. Is this another chance to try some of Navia's macarons? Macarons? I love that. <laughs> yep, I figured you wouldn't say no to a few more. Oh, uh, wait. Let me check if I have all the ingredients. Uh, Malus and Silver used to take care of tasks like this. Aww. Uh, okay, the stove's looking good. And as for the ingredients... Seems like we're all out of flour and sugar. The two most important ingredients of all- I should have some. Oh, would you? Oh, but it would be too much to ask you to go on a trip just for those. I have some! We should contribute to making the macaron too! Don't worry, we cook out in the wild all the time, so he should have some stuff on hand. Yeah. Oh, that's Probably have like great. 200. Then I'll leave the ingredient gathering to you. As long as we have some sweet flours and wheat, I can start the baking. Oh, I definitely have then some. I'll go look for some boxes nearby for a makeshift table and chairs. Love that. Great. Then I'll prep the stove. Let's get to work, everyone. Teamwork makes the dream work. Yeah, give the wheat and sweet flour to Navia. Got it, girly pop. Uh, how did it go? Did you find the ingredients? Oh, yeah, I did. I have 249 <laughs> sweet flowers and 153 pieces of wheat. Take them. All done your part. Just leave the rest to me. Okay. Eagerly awaiting your macarons. Whoa, these macarons look and taste magnificent! Oh my god. Your cooking is as good as ever, Navia. Boss's baking skills. Oh my god, they're so big. Famous. I forgot about that. They're Everyone like little burgers. Spina knows how exceptionally talented she is. Oh, <laughs> it's just a hobby. There's no need to praise me for it like that. You should be proud of yourself. Have you two seriously never considered joining us? You're so close to the boss, and she obviously trusts you with all her heart, so... 
There are still some important things we must do. Huh, yeah, I see. Is that why you have to always stay on the road? Yeah. <laughs> you just happened to walk in on our little reunion. It's actually been quite a while since we last spent time together. Adventurers yeah. never stay in one place for long. The name of Spina di Rosula would just tie them down. Besides, after everything we've been through together, I'm sure our hearts would remain intertwined even if we found ourselves on opposite sides of the world. Navia's right. Hell yeah. Even if Paimon was far beyond the horizon, she'd still remember the delicious taste of Navia's macaron. <laughs> I understand. <laughs> That's now. cute. They look good. And I am very lucky indeed to have been graced with the chance to meet the two of you. I will endeavor to make the most of this short yet fortuitous encounter and enjoy every moment we spend together. We've got no wine with us, but let's still toast with water in celebration of this moment. You can toast with anything, liquid. Oh my god! I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Why'd that, why, why'd that happen? I thought I heard something just now. Was it just some small critter? Cheers! Hey, what are you doing? Quick, join in on the toast! Yeah, cheers! May go smoothly. May the Spina continue to grow. And may our friendship last until the end of time. I don't like that there's just one bush behind us and it's making set, sounds. Out, then. Not after I, I catch this bush on fire. To make uniform, so we should be able to pick it up right away. Yeah. Then whoever is being a creepy creep can never be a creepy creep Let's again. Light it up. Yeah, Benny. Uh -huh. <laughs> Go. It's just this mushroom. Just this mushroom is making the sound. I'm just curious. Down? What do you mean down? Down where? In the water? Nah. I don't want to put that much effort in, but we will mark it. Oh? Oh, that's cool. Okay. Where is she? Okay. Here we go. Besides also trying to get a bunch of Primo Gems for Risley, I also want to up my adventure rank and I'm like halfway to level 58 and I'm like, oh my god, it takes so long. I don't want to be too close. There we go. Okay. Nice. How old is this child? Hey there, Ludovine. How's business lately? She's so cute. Oh my gosh, she's so cute! Spina de Rosula. I must say, your generous patronage is the one thing keeping me from going bankrupt. Aww. <laughs> Nonsense. We all know what a talented businesswoman you are. Oh, and don't forget, she's the boss now. Her just smiles. My mistake, my mistake. I just got so used to calling her Demoiselle. Are you here for the uniform? Yep. I forgot to drop by earlier when I was running errands around here. I love that they're just speaking English and then every time it's like a French word, they just get like a thick French accent. I love that. <laughs> I didn't expect Demoiselle to come and pick it up in person. It's just a uniform after all. Any of your folks could have come instead. Navia's always liked to take even small things seriously. Which is good. Hey, that's not the only reason I'm here. We mostly just needed a walk to clear our heads. There are few things more uplifting than taking the first step on a new journey. Hell yeah. <laughs> uh, boss has got a point. Going on a trip with friends is always better than staying cooped up at home. I'm sure he's innocent, but that guy in the background looking at us like halfway around the building. Creepy. Very well. Please, the bush got me messed up. I retrieve the uniform for you. Hello, the cottage gamer. Hello, hello. Hello. Happy Red Day. Adele wants to join the Spina? <laughs> she hasn't given me any concrete reasons. All she says is that she really looks up to me. After we cleared her father's name, she became a lot more cheerful and outgoing. It's probably because she now knows for sure that her father was never a bad person. That is literally so she sweet. Used to be oh my god, I was right! He is creepy! As a result, she found all the rest of the Spina super scary as well. Hello, yeah, happy red day. You skipped streaming today. You need a break. You gotta take a break, you know? You gotta take care of yourself, your health. I'm just like, might as well. I'm like, gonna just 
relax this morning and then this evening I'll go out for dinner. It's, it's a good red day. But the Spina is very different now. She mustered up the courage to talk to me and felt like I could really understand her. Yeah, the two of you have contended with similar circumstances. I'm freaked out about that guy. Yeah. Is that going to come to a head soon? To see his feet? I'm covering the truth about the case. I was able to give her closure at the same time. I mean, I get that like she a bad thing has to happen, to but still. Someone like me. Someone who could lend a hand to others instead of standing still and waiting for others <laughs> to help her. Feet? From the sound of it, she'll be a wonderful <gasps> Is he gone now? Christina. There's like a guy watching us in the background and you can just like see his feet at one point. Like in, they're in boots, but still. Uh, feet? For free? <laughs> no, unfortunately they're in boots. I there he is. So the creepo in the back. For now, with the red jacket. On giving her a great atmosphere to yeah, there we go. Why has nobody she noticed him yet? She's older and can really make that decision for herself. Who is this man? You saw him? Yeah, yeah, creepy. So I wasn't just hearing things. Yeah, he was the one spying on us is in the shrubbery. The yeah, there's a creepo on foot. Follow me. Someone's tailing us. Huh? Tailing? Oh, Paimon's coming. <gasps> I didn't realize that Paimon has like sparkle sparkle sounds when she flies. Oh my god, I love her even more. I'll go check it out too. Coulter, please hold on to this for me. And I think that we all shouldn't be going. You know? Should just be either. I like this guy is like, okay, I'll just stand in the middle of the street and wait. Oh yeah. Why am I walking? Go. Where are these guys? Are they helping us? I'm over at a cinema. Oh, stream elements won't let you swear. Oh, I'm not using stream elements. <laughs> I couldn't get it to work. Mm. I mean, I cuss sometimes, but I try not to. We knew you were going to be difficult. What do you mean? Seems You're following us. The audacity. To teach them a lesson first. Oh hell yeah! Brothers, Fighting. There's no need to skulk in the dark anymore. Let's take them out. Oh, I think I said beat his ass in a. Oh really? I didn't know that. Well, I don't know what I'm using then. Oh my god, I get to be Navia with her freaking axe. Oh my god. I'm so excited. Oh my god! Jeez Louise. I really, 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 really want her. But I feel like her weapon is what makes it good. Oh hell yeah. Wait, isn't she 5 star? Why did Triangle not have like an animation? Now talk. Yeah. Who are you? And why were you tailing us? Yeah, I'm big mad now. Who are you? Don't think we'll let you off easy if you keep silent. Yeah, recognize your situation and don't entertain any fantasies of escape. I love how dramatic that was. Big mad. How did it go, boss? Are any of you hurt? No, never been better. <laughs> if you thought they stood any chance against us, you were <gasps> sorely mistaken. I love a anyway, confident queen. Stop playing tough and start talking. There won't be any room for negotiation once the Maison Guardianage gets involved. She is such a bad bee. We, I love her. We're looking to get vengeance on Spina de Rosula. We were discovered and can't beat you in a fight. We admit it. We lost. Why? Get revenge? Yeah. Wait. You're not Romeo's followers, are you? Who even are they? You actually know that name? Yeah? But if you do, then surely you should understand why we hate you so much. I advise you to calm down. Indeed. You haven't got the faintest hope of winning right now. <sighs> we were out drinking when we saw Navia. We got so angry we decided to follow you guys and look for an opportunity to really mess up your day. Why? Too bad you guys messed up ours first. You're lying. Huh? You followed us all the way here. Yeah, you were in the shrubbery, so you freak. What? We didn't do anything. And now it should be pretty obvious that we can't do anything to you anyway. Yeah, because you're weak. Seeing you like that just really ticked us off. And we let the drink go to our heads. Listen, Callus is long dead. No matter what happened in the past, I want to be able to start things anew. She's so level-headed. I am the current president of Spina di Rosula. If your boss wants to talk with me, 
I'd be happy to meet with him. Wow. I won't press charges for your attack. That should also help demonstrate my sincerity. Yeah. I understand. Thank you. Huh. I'll let our boss know. The guy in the background but looks so peeved. So much as think about pulling something like this again. I won't be so lenient next time. Understood? Yeah, you tell him. All right. We get it. Come on, let's go. Yeah, go and get. Get out of here. Uh, are you sure it's okay to just let them go like that, Navia? We know what they look like now. I don't want to inherit my father's grudges, too. And moreover, when it comes to the Aquabus, I don't think what my father did was entirely correct, either. If the other Aww. side is willing to talk, I'm happy to open the door for a reconciliation. Opportunities for new beginnings are all around us. She's literally such a great leader. Like, oh my god. I support Boss's decision as well. The concept of an eye for an eye is a primitive practice that has no place in today's Spina di Rosula. That's so true. Yes. Oh my god. Plus, we already know that they're strapped for cash. If their financial situation is that dire, they don't have what it takes to challenge us. So this may be the best time to talk. I still think we should keep an eye out for Romeo spoke so. If he decides to ignore the warning I gave his men, then we could still have a fight on our hands. Totally fine, Nash. I will be streaming Persona again this weekend. Thank you for stopping by. Yeah, those guys definitely didn't look like big fans of yours. Yeah, definitely not. They looked mad. I'd rather things not go that far since, though we haven't talked to each other for years, once upon a time, we were all a part of the Spina di Rosula family. Yep, that's how I feel as well. Yep, I love that. Anyway, now that we've sent them packing, we don't have to worry about those guys anymore. It's getting late already, so why don't we stay the night in the Fleuve Sandra? We can head back to Poisson tomorrow. I'll also ask someone to write Florent a letter and inform him of everything that happened here today so he can increase security around Poisson and be on guard against any suspicious individuals. I always forget that only the traveler can use, like, the waypoints. I'm like, why? Why don't we just use the waypoints? Like, oh, they can't. Do we have to stay in the Fleuve Sondo again? Even the pillows there smell like seaweed. Come <laughs> so, on. That's just <clears throat> what happens when you live near water and don't get much sunlight. Poisson's pretty much the same, though, so I've long since gotten used to it. We can still go out in the evening for some grilled fish and drinks, though. Bet you there'll be people singing sea shanties, too. How does that sound? Sounds good. Uh, that does sound pretty cool. Okay, Paimon's on board now. <laughs> Let's go! Paimon wants to sing, too! Even Ether's like, what the heck, Long? <laughs> no, baby, what are you doing? Okay. Oh, Navia gave us a gift! No, it's not for us. Sorry. <laughs> I was like, oh, she gave us something! And it's like, no, it's not for us, though. Yeah, I just want to see. Navia prepared this gift, which contains a Spina di Rosula uniform for Adele. The dimensions are a bit large for Adele at present, but it will works just fine for a promise. <laughs> Destroy! Why is that even an option? No, I don't want to do that. Okay. Where am I going? Ugh, I love these, like, sparkles that tell me where I need to go. I wish they had these in real life, because I'm always lost. Right. Open the door. Woo! Okay. Oh, I forgot. This is like the underground place. Can't I? Just... Yeah. Can't I just do this? Why walk if you don't have to? Wait, I want to see the big turtle. Is it up here? Where's the big turtle? Yeah! Hello, big guy. You are beautiful. Er, hello? Hello? Yeah, that's right, he can't talk. I just love that he's here. Like, well, he just straight vibing. But are you really an ordinary run of the mill tortoise? Does he have like a bigger thing going on? Like, very interesting. I want him to like sell me stuff. Thank you. This is indeed a truth to be held self evident. Alright, bye, my dude. Biggest turtle I ever saw. Okay, wait, 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 w
There we go. Perfect. Coming back here really does feel like this place is starting to grow on Paimon. Last time we were here, Mona was here. If you think about it, it would be kind of weird if the Spina's base at the court was some super luxurious building like the Palais Mermonia. Yeah. <laughs> totally. Right on the money, Paimon. Although, of course, with the continued growth of the Spina, Papa wanted Poisson to eventually grow into a metropolis, not unlike the court. Oh. He was a very ambitious man, who rarely looked behind or beneath him. For better or worse, that always made him stand out from the crowd. And that's also why people hated him just as much as they loved him. All right. Why don't you go wait for me at the restaurant? I'll go do some prep and I'll get someone to tidy up your room while I'm at it. You can use the same room as last time. You still remember the room number, yeah? No. Yep, yep. Okay. It's kind of hard to forget when there are only so many rooms here after all. Thank God one of us knows what's going on. <laughs> Did I just hear someone taking a dig at Fleuve Sandra? I'll tell my guys to stuff your pillows full of actual seaweed right now. What? Paimon, shut up. I'm sorry. Please have mercy, Navia. If you do that, then Paimon really won't be able to sleep at all. <laughs> I was just kidding. Be on your way now. All right. Sit inside and wait for the banquet to begin. I can do that. Ooh, let's talk to the bartender. What are, you, what are you selling? Can I solve any problems? Theoretically, I do not believe there's any problem that can only be solved by force. When we of the Spina de, de Rasula act, I'm certain that we'll, we will be able to resolve anything from things as small as living supplies and household affairs to matters as large as factional disputes. I don't know how I was supposed to read that fast. Oh, am I just supposed to? Oh, I'm supposed to talk to people then. Okay, okay. I can do that. Wait, no, it says sit. Sit. Sit down. There we go. Perfect. I can read directions. You enjoy a fantastic meal as well as a wonderful performance. Oh my god, as things slow down, you return to your room with Paimon. Hello. Why is it so fast? Are you asleep yet? Did something happen? Oh no, not at all. I just figured that since we don't get to enjoy nights like these very often, we should try to enjoy it to the fullest. Oh, amazing. Yes, please. Go fishing? I've got some rods and lures ready. <laughs> oh, so that's the prep you were talking about. Oh, we'll come. Okay. She is so cute. I love Navia. <laughs> Hopefully I didn't wake you or anything. Well, since the invitation's coming from <laughs> I you. I knew it. You really are my best partner. Okay, let's go. To the fishing spot. I miss fishing. I used to fish all the time with my dad. I heard in Korea there's like fishing cafes. And I'm like, I actually kind of am interested. But I actually haven't seen any. I've just been told that they exist. So hopefully one day I'll be able to find out. Why is it underground? Okay, whatever. We'll go. Swim. Okay. okay. I like that underwater, if you run into Santa Mal, you just have to go slow instead of just straight up passing out. So let's go. Down. I want to swim as long as I can. Okay. Whoa! The fishing rods look good! <laughs> I love that. Way easier. Yeah. But I like it, Paimon. Be quiet. Mm -hmm. What's the problem? Lots of people in Poisson use rods like these. But, but shouldn't fishing be all about, you know, attentively watching the float? And then excitedly reeling in the catch when you finally hook something? Well, is it? One way to enjoy fishing. What do you think, Traveler? Automation is more efficient. <laughs> That's how I feel as well. To me, I'm happy as long as I catch some fish. Honestly, Paimon's mainly shocked at how much energy you still have yeah. this hour. Usually by this time of night, it's a struggle for Paimon to even keep her eyes open. Huh. It might just be something that runs in my family. Navi is a night owl. It can be. <laughs> I'm sure you'd get even sleepier if I delved more deeply into it. Anyway, I was just thinking about how grateful I am to my mother. 
as well as the rest of the Spina. Your mother? My father always had a lot of unrealistic oh my God, the crabs. for me. But the more that he tried to get me to become like him, the less I wanted to listen to what he had to say. Valid. My mother never had those kinds of expectations, though. I've heard that she had only one wish for me, which was that I would have a happy and secure childhood. What a All good the mom. of the Spina greatly respected her wish, so no matter what I did as a child, they were happy to humor me. <laughs> Can you imagine? Whenever my father wanted to scold me for something I'd done, everyone would form up into two rows and just stand silently and listen to him rant. Malus and Silver were always there, too. No matter what Papa yelled, nobody else would say a word. Eventually, Papa must have recognized scolding me over trivial matters was pointless, because he eventually stopped getting on my case so often. Jeez. Paimon would have never guessed. <laughs> I like that everybody was there. Yeah. Looking back on it now as an adult, I can hardly believe how patient and kind everyone was. When I was young, I often thought that I could do whatever I wanted, because there'd always be someone there to clean up after me. But once, I saw Malus come back wounded. He wouldn't tell me how he'd been injured, but I could tell it had something to do with me. Oh. I learned then that there's always a cost to making a mistake. The more you care about those around you, the more you should care about doing the right thing to the best of your abilities. Because... If you do falter, there'll inevitably come a time when you'll have to face the consequences. And when that time comes, those most precious to you really will throw themselves in front of you and pay the price for your mistakes. So sad, oh my god. And her character Sorry. development, oh my god. I shouldn't ah! have said that. I wasn't planning to talk about sad things tonight. Basically, I was just saying that the nurturing atmosphere of the Spina must have been my mother's legacy, rather than my father's. Probably, yeah. If that's the only way that I can continue to feel her love, then I'd like to pass that warmth on. I mean, she's new, um, I know, right? Her design is amazing, Cottage. She's new, she's like a new character that was introduced in Fontaine, so she's not like brand new, like, like this week new or anything, but she is like a Fontaine character. I literally love her. I did not roll for her because I'm still trying to save up for Risley, but she's good. Yeah, she's not annoying at all, and she's badass, and her weapon is a freaking axe. I love her. I think she's literally, like, my favorite female character in Genshin Impact. Is that why you let those guys go today? Like, level-headed, sweet, kind, <laughs> tough. Although... Maybe there's a part of not wanting to repeat the mistakes of the past. I want to be reasonable, at least. Like she's, I don't know, she like multifaceted, like she's not just one thing. Hey, she's got range. Look, I think you've got something on the line. Oh hell yeah, we got a fish. Uh, but why isn't the rod automatically reeling it in? That's a valid question, yeah. Uh, oh, there must be something wrong with how I installed the mechanism. It was my first time putting one of those rods together. It's fine, you tried. We can't let it get away. Come on, you two. Let's catch it. Yeah. Y you want Paimon to help too? Yeah. You wanna eat, don't you? After some time, you finally managed to reel in the prize catch together. For the rest of the night, your rod continues to rack up catch after catch, while for some reason, Navia can't seem to hook a single fish. Jeez. Oh yeah, I've seen some people that like made cosplays for her and they looked absolutely spectacular but i was like oof the effort the time the effort navia is quite upset about her bad luck but it's only when you begin to head back that paimon discovers the real reason to the mystery of why she didn't get a single bite yeah what the heck you you didn't attach a hook to your line oh my god <laughs> poor girl she's just trying her best yeah, I feel Stop like time. The boss ain't gonna wait all day. Huh? <gasps> oh no. Yeah, I feel like I one of the main reasons why I cosplayed as Barbara was because it was pretty okay. 
I just did like casual, like just gotta get her hair, but I'm like, Navia feels like it'd be really, really difficult. We'll go ahead with the operation tomorrow. Do with that information as you wish. Hmm. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> well, your rod was missing a part too, so I guess that makes it fair. I am hyped well, for tomorrow. If we're just talking about the number of missing parts. Wait, is this still the same night? No wonder Paimon's tired. Jeez. Oh, never mind. Paimon really can't keep her eyes open anymore. <laughs> Alright. Go to bed. I had a great time today. Aw. See you tomorrow, Navia. Mm -hmm. See you tomorrow. I like forgot that today was Wednesday for a second. Oh. How was last night? Did you get a good night's sleep? We're like, are you hyper tomorrow? I was like, what's tomorrow? We're meeting Thursday. And then it was like, oh, tomorrow is Thursday. <laughs> Paimon dreamt that she danced with the sea stars. So you could say it was stellar. Get it? That was cute. Huh. Navia, come on. <laughs> and just where did you get that from? <laughs> I didn't know you had such a great sense of humor. Yeah, I thought it was cute. Kind of the jokes that I make. <laughs> anyway, let's head out. I'll arrange for a boat to take us back to Poisson. Poisson! I'm sure Adele will be happy to see you two again. Mimi drop my Poisson. Paimon hopes she'll really appreciate your gift. I hope so too. Hey. Quest completed. Oh, nice! I got a fishing rod! Hell yeah! Whenever it's like in the bottom right corner, I can never find it and then I'm always confused. Okay, that's fine. We'll go over here. Yeah, I definitely want to get as many primos as possible. It's like there's this one, this one, this one, this one. One, two, three, four. And then I can't do hers yet, but there's probably four or five endings. And there's five endings, five endings, five endings. And then you get like two, four, six. When there's five endings, you get 60 primal gems. This is like 120. And then 160 right there. Amazing. I wonder how many I get. Yeah, 60. Sweet. Okay. It's actually quite cool. You get the same amount, but instead of having like multiple different story endings, you just have one long story. Any more like there, I never come over here. Down, down where? Hold on, I want to know. Down where? There, down there. Down where? Down there. Okay. Amazing. Smell. <laughs> Sorry, Razor, cutting you off. Okay, let's try again. I like that there's this literal, like, like you can go this way, and it's like, or I can just fly down and not have to walk at all. You're getting my preferred way of transportation. Adele, we're back. We brought you a gift from the court too. Yeah. Whoa, oh, she's so cute. So oh, I remember them. Don't call her boss, okay, Adele? Just Miss Navia would be fine. Aww. Oh, <laughs> it's all right. I don't mind. Besides the gift, I've also got another surprise. Guess who's here? But guess who's here? It's Finnewell! As we stand directly next to her. Oh, it's you two. It has been a while indeed. Thank you so much for your help on Jacques' case. Our pleasure. I've heard that you also help save all of Fontaine. You're truly just like the great heroes of legend. Aww. You're really amazing. And if Miss Navi is your friend, then she must be super amazing too. You got that right, girly. What's in this thing? Can I look? What's in this thing? It's yours. Go ahead. It's your present. It looks so cute. I love the box too. Zerosula uniform. Is it for me? She is but a kid. Isn't it a bit big? Earlier she's like, oh, but she's just a kid. I was like, is she really a kid or is she like 
Like, is she like a baby baby? But it's like, nah, she's a baby. Well, it's a gift for future you. When you first told me that you were interested in joining the Spina, I was overjoyed. But it's the Spina's responsibility to protect everyone as well. Being a member means becoming involved in all kinds of dangerous situations. And since you're still young, I don't want your mom to have to worry about your safety. So Aww. I turned you down then by telling you that you'll have to wait until you're older. But this uniform is a promise that you can join us once you're old enough to wear it. I love that. That's actually really sweet. She knows that this is important to her. Oh, she wants you to know she's not lying. Well, thank you so much, Miss Melvia. I'll work hard and grow up as fast as I can. <laughs> Uh, but you can't really grow up faster by working hard. You've got to be patient. Everyone, I'm really grateful that you remembered my daughter's wish and took it seriously. Thanks to the protection of the Spina, even though her father's no longer with us, we've still felt plenty of warmth and security. Oh, oh it's the least we could do. As long as you live in Poisson, even if you're not an official member, you're still part of the family. That's so sweet. I feel bad for the lady. Oh no! It's going down! Huh? Is something up, Florent? I've got something urgent to report. Romeu and his folks have gathered outside <gasps> Poisson and even shipped in a huge what? pile of explosives! A huge pile? What? Explosives? Oh my god, the little What's girl. Want? Me too. It seems like they've been planning this for some time. We started investigating as soon as we received your letter yesterday. But Romeu and his folks must have gotten wind as well. Because they abandoned their former posts before we could even check on them. Oh my god. We investigated their tracks and found out that they're after Poisson. Why? Could they have smartened up since we caught them red-handed at the court? Seems like they've got no interest in sitting down and talking at all. What the actual they heck? Down straight to the Maison Guardianage. Well, there's like innocent people there. Sorry. I, I underestimated the situation. Well... Too late now, I suppose. Florent, where are they keeping their explosives? On the hill to the east of Poisson, near the Clementine Line. Are they gonna blow up the line? They want to blow up the Clementine Line? The mom line? Certainly Hell no. Sounds like it. Romeo and his followers hate the Spina and everything to do with Callus, and the Aquabus was the source of their contention. If they manage to blow up the Aquabus line. All that rubble will come crashing down the hill and straight into Poisson. Oh my god. Are they insane? Yeah. Tons of innocent people in Poisson. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. You have to stop them. they've been planning this for ages, they're definitely not going to let this opportunity slip by. What the heck? We have to issue an evacuation order to the townspeople and get them as far away from the entrance as possible. That should save them from the worst of it. Jeez. Let's get everyone onto our ship. That should be the safest place. That's true. My dear Gosh. Friend, can I leave the Clementine line to you? Oh, hell yeah. If the explosives do go off, not only would the people of Poisson be in danger, any Yeah, they're going to just kill so many people for what? The ground. Let's Despicable. Stop their insanity first, then settle the score with them. Oh, I love that she's keeping a level head. Leave it to us, Navia. I couldn't. Okay. Let's go, you two. We've got to act fast. Miss Coralie, please take Adele to the ship. <gasps> oh my god, what? <gasps> Watch out, boss! Oh my freaking god, are you kidding me? <sighs> Is he bad? <gasps> and that's why he wanted to go on a walk alone with us. That's why he I wanted to. All the annoying little hindrances had left, but I still couldn't get rid of you. My God. You mean this was all a trick, so that you'd be left alone with me? What the actual heck? Coulter, are you with Romeo too? Oh. <laughs> I get it now. You knew about their plans all along. You only the told the little girls they were like ready to so throw down. Drop our guard. Not quite. Though I share their positions on some issues, I've never cared for his more radical ideas. So why are you okay to stab her? And that's because 
Out of the entire Spina di Rosula, I only hate what? you. What? Only you, Navia. Were you in love with her mom? Are you a creep? What's you going on? Close to me. Oh my god. Romeo promised me that he would leave Fossa alone if I could just take you out. What? But it was like you were glued at the hip to that pesky traveler. You never gave me a chance to make my move. Romeo has lost his patience. I didn't have to be here today, you know. But I swore that I'd kill you, even if it meant being buried with you in the rubble. Oh my god. Why? Yeah, why? Only someone as clueless about the past as you would ask such a foolish question. Oh my gosh. You never saw the heyday of Spina di Rosula, nor did you ever live through the golden age of Poisson. But I, I saw it all with my own eyes, and then I had to watch it all die, little by little. Yeah, but the golden point can't last forever. And it was all because of you, Navia. Oh my god. Clementine died because of you. Callus died because of you. Malus and Silver died because of you. And oh my so god. many more dead. Everyone dead. All because of you. What the actual heck is wrong? You showed us before. That was an act too? Now you're catching on. I heard Malus was dead the moment I got out. Oh my god. Did you know? Down there in that blasted fortress, I spent a long time thinking about what happened and resolving to apologize to Malus as soon as I got out. Back then, because of that aqua bus, we had a huge fallout. I was convinced that all he cared about was loyalty and that he had completely lost his capacity for critical thinking. Oh my god. The years passed by in a blur after that. I thought I had finally begun to understand him and that he could help me relive the good old days again. But then he died, and it was because of you again, Navia. It's always because it of you. It is not because of her. Oh, my God. <laughs> How could you say that? I once loved the Spina and Poisson more than anyone else. But what is left now of either besides death and ruin? You've single-handedly destroyed everything. He needs to get a therapist. That was beautiful. Everything I've ever loved. Don't listen to him, boss. Yeah. He's just spouting nonsense. Like, what the actual heck? As if she's the reason the primordial sea overflowed and there was a flood. Have Sir. Have you considered that? Maybe the people around you don't actually care about you at all. No, we didn't consider that because it's just Have you. Have you ever considered that? Maybe you only get respect because you're Callus and Clementine's child? That you've never done anything worthy? That you're just a big nothing? Oh my god! Have you ever considered that? Maybe people don't stay in Poisson because of you, but only because they have such beautiful memories of the past before you came. Stop projecting. If you do falter, there no. will come a time when you'll have to face the I'm getting more and more mad. How dare you talk to her that way? And when that time comes, those most precious to you really will throw themselves in front of you and pay the price for your mistakes. <laughs> yeah. Looking back on it now as an adult, I can hardly believe how patient and kind Ugh. everyone was. I'm so mad. Is that really why they support me? No, Navia, no, Navia, no. Is real? He's just a bitter old man. Shut your mouth. Yeah, shut your mouth. For one, really like Miss Navia. And my mom loves her too. Yeah, you tell him, Adele. Put him in his place. I don't know how to explain it, but I like her. And that's that. That's that. I'm sure, Mr. Malus would be extremely disappointed in you right now. Yeah, Malus would be pissed. You somehow managed to pin the blame for every mistake and tragedy in our history on the boss herself. Yeah. Get out of the way, Florent. I don't want to hurt you. Well, we want to hurt you, so I bring it. I have to. Boss, there's no time for this. Stop hesitating and get out of here before you get buried. Oh my god. I think you're being the realist by painting the history of the Spina and Poisson like I'm this. I'm so mad. But the love that I felt from everyone was just as real. I felt it. They've helped me get to where I am. And even now, I will continue to believe in that love. So let me show you just how much I love the Spina di Rosula. Yeah, where's your axe? Are we fighting? Are we fighting or are we going to be ether? Oh, hell yeah. Umbrella warfare, I guess. 
Oh my god. I'm used to the other game. I'm pressing square. Square's not even the button. Okay, you're getting out first, sir. My god, I love her fighting style. I want to see the like animation picture. Yeah. I don't even know what's going on. I can't see. He's button mashing. Okay. Talk to Florent. Where is he? Ugh. Yeah. Good. Where'd he go? Florent, I'll leave the town to you. Summon the other members and help with the There he is in the background of the, of the ground. If you find any of Coulter's accomplices, subdue them quickly. And don't give them the chance to harm any ordinary civilians. I can't allow my partner to face the danger on the Clementine line alone. Oh my god, I literally freaking love her. I don't understand how anybody cannot love her. Are you okay, Navia? I think physically she's okay, but mentally probably but not. To go. Which is valid. Oh, and this is just Act 1. Are we still in Act 1? A short while earlier, you and Paimon dashed to the entrance of Poisson. Let's hurry up there. Oh, the we graveyard. Protect the Clementine line. If they're yeah. Up the waterway, they must have planted the explosives next to the support pillars. Big brain, Paimon. Oh, shoot. Okay, hold on. Oh my god, we gotta fight everybody? I should have brought out a different no, team for this. That's okay. One with my blade. Oh my god. Oh, there's another guy. Sir, we are in a hurry. There we go. There we go, Razor. Okay. Not me being like, is there a treasure chest? Okay, at least they're humans. Not like the robots. Go fast. Where are you? Go. Let's go. They're really slowing us down. They are. We're meeting resistance. We must be heading in the right direction. And we are. Witness the power of Kuwa. Force my play. From whence you came. Okay, so hopefully I just realized we probably shouldn't attack the uh, the bombs. Okay, talk to Paimon. Sure thing. This must be the explosives, right? And this is the control mechanism. Uh how can we disable it? I do not know. Oh, Paimon's too scared to touch any of this stuff. Ooh, there's a big key. There's a strangely shaped hole here. What is it for? Could be some kind of key. Oh, that certainly sounds possible. Uh, maybe one of the people we just beat up has the key. Ooh, probably. Okay, you take this side. Paimon will take the other. Let's see what we can find. Oh my god, now we're looting? Key. Okay, we just got money. Are we actually taking their money? Why does he have a radish? Okay. Oh, you found it! That's oh, hi, Paimon. What is this weird angle? I want- I want to move. Okay, there we go. Oof! Eat the baby! Hi, Will! Everyone hates Paimon but me. How you doing, man? That should do it, right? <sighs> we can Navia help. And Florent should be able to relax now. Oh, you're right. They could have set explosives elsewhere, too. Let's go. They probably did. I'll be shocked if they only put explosions in this one spot. Who the heck is in the trees watching us? <gasps> oh, I get it. I get it. I bet that was a detour too. A detour. Can we even do anything? Oh my god, traveler. Yes. Get it. Holy crap. Whoa, 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 whoa. <gasps> oh my god. I like that they just had him equipped with Geo even though we were obviously equipped with Hydro earlier. Great work, we love that. Just leave the rest to me. Oh, are we Geo because she's Geo? Ah, I love it. Luck. <laughs> I'm doing this the Spina way. I love her! Hell yeah. She is literally everything. I'm 
I'm happy you're here too, Will. Thank you. I hope that you can sleep well. Huh? Oh my god, get it, girl! Fire! Yay, finally I get to see it! Oh! I love her. I love her so much. Never have I ever wanted to roll for somebody as badly as this hangout event has made me want her. Claymore is my favorite. Oh, we love a queen. A Claymore queen. He's okay? Alright, sick. And then she immediately passes out. <laughs> that was a lot of hard work. Okay. Nope, I didn't get to read it. Why does it go so fast? I read too slow. All right, the bad guys have been arrested. I hear from that even they're your enemies now. They were once a part of Spina di Brusula. Do you plan to settle this privately with them? I have nothing more to say to them. Yeah, what the heck? Just Regardless arrest them. Of whether their hatred and anger towards me or the Spina was justified, anyone who's willing to endanger innocent civilians is no longer sane enough to even be worth trying to talk to. Yeah. Please prosecute them in accordance to the law. Spina di Rosula will not raise any objections. She looks cool because she is cool, Will. She's literally the coolest. I love her. Sounds good. We're very appreciative of good your taste. Help. Without it, the consequences would have been far worse. All right. This operation is a wrap. Take him away. Hello, Fernando. Everyone. You are so cool. She yeah. is cute. <laughs> Luckily, we were just in time. Yeah, like you look pale. We're, we're going well. We're, we're doing the uh, story quest for Navia. I want these primos. I already knew that I liked Navia, but now with this like hangout quest, I am like, she is literally the best. I was literally just going to say that, Will. She's everything. It's probably because I expended too much elemental energy at once. I'll be fine. Don't worry about me. Like, they put all the effort into her character. You can tell. You usually glow up whenever other people compliment you. I'm not used to seeing you like this. Yeah, she's probably exhausted. It's a lot of work. Boss, we managed to catch all the infiltrators in the town. The Maison Guardianage is taking them away as well. Good. Seems like Romeu really went all in on this mission. If he sent literally everyone he had, though, that also means we've caught them all. Too. Okay, good. Sick. We won't have to worry about them from now on. Thank God. <sighs> Got it. That's good, at least. Ah, <sighs> there he is. Coulter, I can understand how you feel. Oh my God! The things that we lost—they're forever beyond our grasp now, and that makes them appear even more precious. I am not callous, and I will also never become him. The Spina and the Poisson that you loved are both gone. Is she really sympathizing with him? Oh my god. But Girl. I will not change how I feel about our future. I still believe that this is a great opportunity to start anew. I will spend more of what the Spina earns on the betterment of Poisson. What's more, I'd also like to propose some changes to the Aquabus routes. So that one day... The people of Poisson will enjoy the boons it brings as well. Oh my gosh. I know what you're trying to say. She's literally perfect. Mr. Callus would never have said anything like that. You've never played? This is a pretty good game. I like it. I have to be honest though. I was invested for the twins storyline. And at this point, like that's like the main character storyline. It feels like it's been put on the back burner. But the voice acting is literally amazing. And like... All the characters are really great. Like, it's a really, really good game. It's really good. <laughs> Thank you. I am hyped up. There are too many things in life that are just beyond our control. In that, we are the same. Henceforth, you are no longer a member of Spina di Rosu. Good. But once you're discharged from Oh my god, Spina, wait. You're welcome to pay another visit to Poisson. He was out of jail for like four days, and now he's immediately going back to jail. Why is he so stupid? You, Navia. You don't deserve her in your life. Get out. Go. Ugh. And you're so- oh, never mind. 
I was gonna say something about his fit, but the other guy has like the same fit. Ross really is a oh. kind and gentle person. Yes. She is also, I must say, a truly unlucky <laughs> person. Oh my gosh. Thank you for protecting the Clementine line. Not the, not the bad guys really in the background scared, vibing. You know? I mean, even the Callus line won't be getting rebuilt anytime soon. If I'd lost the Clementine line too, I wouldn't Aww. know how to live with myself. A name oh, is a way to etch a memory onto the world. Losing the line that bears her name, that I can see every day, would be like losing my mother all over again. See, Good thing we stopped it. There, tall and proud. It makes me really happy. Good. What happened while you were gone? Honestly, you look more upset than tired or anything. Yeah. Just give her some time. Okay, everything's fine. Nah. Let's see, I'll get you back to mm. Poisson. Thank you so much. Can you give me a hand? I really don't have much strength left. My god, poor girl. Traveler. Oh! I want to ask you something. And please... Tell me the truth. Literally is so cute. Do you really see me as your partner? Oh my gosh, of she's course. so precious. <gasps> That's good then. You got to hear. Hearing that. The VA. It brings me more relief than I can say. Oh my god. Ah! Is it done? Is this it? Is this the end? This can't be the end. Is it the end? How do you feel now? Okay, Dad? I was like, whoa. Any better after taking a break? God. I feel quite a bit better. But I should probably still rest for a few more days. Sorry, partner. I said some weird things earlier. Uh, feel free to just ignore me. Yeah, but well, that's because I've never heard you doubt yourself before. I used to think that I'd never doubt myself. But you could say I've discovered that I'm not as strong as I thought I was. No, oh, you're that's so strong. My parents. As well as Malus and Silver. It's all thanks to them that I've made it this far in life. This shot is also freaking gorgeous. Whoever at Hoyoverse is like, yeah, this is the shot. So good. Do you think they ever regretted the choices they made? Has my existence made this world a better place? Yeah, Don't better place for us. Nadia. You've already done more than enough. No matter what others think, we'll always support you to the end of the world. Hell yeah. I agree with Paimon. Say something nice. Say something nice. Well, since it's ended up like this, I suppose it's time for me to make a confession as well. There's something that I've been keeping from you as well, boss. Oh my god. Please, follow me. Everything is already prepared. It has to be something good, because there was already something bad. Carl Weezer voice. Kwasong! I can't do his voice, but still. You mean Jimmy Neutron? <laughs> Carl Weezer? That's Carl Weezer, right? Uh, Florong, I hope you can understand that I can't deal with any more shocking revelations right now. Yeah, is it like a party? Don't worry. This surprise will be a pleasant one. Okay, good. Ugh. It's like, I can't handle any more betrayal. I don't know about- I know Navia can, but even I. I cannot- I cannot handle any more. Oh, what? What is this? Yeah, we're gonna just, uh, nope. We're gonna just go straight down into the, uh, the underground. Okay. Let's see. I love this place. A little underground cave. I also love that there's parts in Fontaine that are, like, super beautiful and, like, nature-esque. And then we have places like this that are very industrial, very steampunk. Best of both worlds. Oh my god, please let me land on this bridge. Oh, oh hey, there's one of the fishing rods from earlier. As I fall directly into the water. Jeez, okay. Wait, 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 wait. Are we still act one? This is still act one? Oh my god. Is it just one act? I assume there would be three acts, but I also don't know if that's a fact. Okay. This ramp. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, we love Jimmy Neutron. Why is everyone gathered here? And what's this? <laughs> oh, that's this exactly right. Hell yeah. From everyone in the town. We were originally planning to show it to you once it was finished. Well, the diver girl. 
Special times call for special measures. I've never seen you look so defeated before. So I've decided to show you the designs before the final product was done. Okay. I... Do I really look that bad? Yeah, I hate to break it well, to you, but you do. <laughs> you ready? I'll unveil the present. Need some cheering up. Hmm. Is it the statue from the beginning? Okay, her eyes got real big. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> oh my god! Mom and dad. Oh, and she's in the photo too? Oh, so cute. My god, I love it, I love it, I love it. I love that we get to see what her mom and dad look like. This is... Perfect. Papa, mother. And me. I think it's a good statue. We designed the look for Miss Clementine based on old camera records. As well as personal recollections from members of Vespina. Oh my god. Wow. This is the statue you mentioned before? It's perfect. It is indeed. To be honest, we decided on the design a long time ago and gave the sculptor permission to begin working. Oh, then why'd they ask we us? We only asked Boss to decide on a design so she wouldn't realize we had already started. Oh, that's smart. That's smart. How could we only have statues of Mr. Callus and Mrs. Clementine? Hmm. Boss Let me think, Fernando. Still young. We've all seen the work she's put in regarding the whole synth business and the rebuilding of Poisson. We wanted to commemorate her contributions with the statue as well. I mean, the thing with the, uh, with this game, it is grindy a little bit, I think, personally, but it's also one of the only games that I've ever played that, like, not only do you have to level your character up, but you also have to, like, level up their talents so their, like, attacks are stronger, and you also have to, like, give them things called artifacts to kind of, like, help them be stronger as well. And then there's also something called constellations that, like, you can get more and then your character becomes stronger. But I don't usually, like, care about those too much and I still have, like, a good time. I also feel like, though, you can play the game however you want. Like, I'm, I haven't super been invested in any of the stories in, like, a long time. Like, honestly, like, besides this Navia story, I haven't been invested in what feels like forever. So you're free to just like run around the world and like get treasure and fight and like have a fun time, which is usually what I do. And then it's like if I'm interested in the story, like I'll play through it. And if I'm not interested in the story, I don't. So I think it just depends on how you want to play it. Like, I guess that's what I like about it is it feels like very flexible. You know, like if you want to focus on fighting, you can. If you want to focus on the story, you can. But something that I do like about it is that there's always something to do. You are never bored in this game. I don't know what Spina di Rosula was like in the past, but I know it's a great organization now. With Navia around, we're not worried about this place's future. And like all the story stuff for the most part, besides like the actual main storylines are optional. Like I'm doing what I'm doing right now because I wanted to. Like if I didn't want to do it, I didn't have to like go through this, which I also like. We are gathered here today to tell our <coughs> that we support you and believe in you wholeheartedly. I believe everyone is here for you, not the glory days. That is so sweet. I'm so happy for her. I will also always believe in the bond between us. Thank you so much, everyone. Then I'll be oh, brave sorry. and just I'm accept my everyone's support for what it is. Breakfast smoothie. This really is quite oh, the surprise. God. I never thought that I'd have the chance to stand next to my mother. Not even in my wildest dreams. I love this for her. All right. Act one completed. What do you mean to be continued? I got- Oh! Does that mean there's gonna be like a- Another one? Later? Cause she's just gone. Okay. Very fun. Very cool. Yeah, like, these are story quests. So like, I don't particularly love- love Farina's character. So I don't know if I'll do this ever. But I really, really like- this character a lot so i'll probably do hers and i thought chiori was okay so maybe i'll do hers but like i don't have to they will just sit here until i decide to do them 
No, everything's free. These just unlock when the story like hits that point, but they are free. You have to like get these keys, but you don't have to pay any money for the keys. You just get the keys by doing like things in the game. Like you can't buy them with money. Like the only option is to do things in the game. And then there's these ones that they're also optional if like you want to do them. And I like a lot of the four star characters more than the five star characters. <coughs> like there's five different endings for this character. And then you get like different prizes. Like you pretty much just want to get a bunch of these, the primal gems, because then you can get characters. That's part of why I just did the story I did, because I'm like, I want to get primos. It's like I have 190, um, what are those called? Intertwined fates, so I can roll 190 times for either of these characters, but I don't want them. I'm saving up for a different one. But no, all the story and stuff is free. Oh, I can talk to her? Hell yeah. It seems like I started to question myself a bit too much. I'll pick myself up again and become a more reliable president for all of you. Looking you should play. It, it's good. I am honestly embarrassed by how I acted earlier. <laughs> um, I don't want to embarrass her, so we're not going to bring up. Let's do about Clementine. You know, I've thought about it before. Though my mother only wanted me to live a happy life, that's actually a tall order as well. In practice, it's just as hard to achieve my father's expectations for me. Yeah, I feel like that's Even actually not easy. Have very different personalities. They always had a lot of respect for each other. The Aquabus project was a monumental project that stood to benefit all see the, the drawing. Fontaine. It so would have cute. been a little close-minded to assess or evaluate it only from the perspective of the clan. I think that's probably why she didn't step in to mediate or oppose the oh my god, of the lines. kitty cat. I hope this stays here forever. I can't climb it, but that's okay. Yeah, when you get characters, like this is my favorite character. So he's level 90. And then you have these things called artifacts. Which like, these are the artifacts that I have on him. And there's like a bunch of different options. But like these make your characters stronger. And there's like constellations. There's six of them. I have all six for this character. And they also make him stronger. Like, I do more damage. Or my crit rate goes up. Or one of my attacks goes up. Like things like that. And then talents as well, like makes them stronger. But I also gotta say, I played this game for you call me. a really long time, and I didn't ever like pay attention to those. And I still got pretty far. And the only reason I started to actually like try with those is that a friend was like, "Oh no, you you should do these things. It makes it easier." And I was like, "Oh, okay, cool." So <laughs> like, you don't technically have to. It definitely helps, but you don't have to. Oh, there it is. Okay. Man, it is raining. That was a lot faster than I expected. I think I'm gonna run around a little bit before I have to go. Well oh my god, I hate the ones that have, like, the creepy voice. Bring out my stand. This is why he's my favorite. He has a stand. And it's really, really strong. Oh no, she's down too far. No, why'd you go up? Oh my god. No? Oh, I don't like that. Okay, okay. Oh, there's another guy over there. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, there's people, there's lots of people like me that are like free to play. Like, I do not put any money into this game. Like, I feel like happy that I'm free to play, if that makes sense. Like, there's quite a lot of people like that. Like, there's definitely people who pay, but if you pay, you're pretty much only, like, the only option is to, like, pay for characters. Like, you can pay money to get chances to roll for characters, or to, like, buy the outfits. Like, some characters have outfits, but that's it. Like, all the story's free, you know? Good for <laughs> Yeah, stand user confirmed. He's literally amazing. 
what was I trying to find? Oh, and there's also like a bunch of events. Like there's a, an event right now about cats. There's like an event right now as well about like shooting stuff. You can also try out the characters to see if you like them. There's a card game. There's lots. Okay, let's see. Because like my, like straight up, besides being invested in like the main character's storyline, mm. My favorite part of the game is literally running around and like 100%ing the map. Like this area right here is at 92%, but the rest of the map up until a certain point I have 100%ed. And that's literally like what makes me happy. <laughs> I just want to 100% my map. All I want. Okay, let's see. Is it real mint? Yeah. No! Oh my god! It's not real! Oh, you did that with God of War? I've heard of that game. But I have not played it. But I heard people liked it a lot. Ah! Okay. Wait, what? I can't stop because it will kill me. I don't even need what this thing drops, but they terrify me, so I'm killing it. I hate them. I gotta play it? What's, what system is it for? I'm intrigued. Where? Where is the treasure chest? Is this way? Okay. Bet. I'm at 92%. Hell yeah. I want 100%. I'm probably not going to get 100% anytime soon, but you never know. Where are you? There it is. Okay. Let's bring him out. PlayStation and PC? Good. I got both of those. I will watch a little trailer for it and see. The latest is PS5? Sick. Good. Ah! Oh my god. I see that I can't reach out while doing this. Okay, we're bringing out the stand again. Oh no, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I love when there's so much going on I can't even see. Ooh, my backfired. I got frozen. Wait, you should be dead. You have like 3 HP. What are you doing? Can't even see. <gasps> that is so great! Your girlfriend got you the PS5 and God of War. And you legit bald. That literally happened to me. I wasn't paying attention and Razor died. I my husband got me the PlayStation 5 and then Final Fantasy 7 Integrade for my birthday. Like back when Integrade came out. And I was literally so excited. Damn it, Razor. Okay, Chang Yin, get out here. This is what I get. I gotta pay more attention. <laughs> and I'm so sorry! Yeah, hell yeah. Can I run away and like change my party? I don't feel like this is a good party for this. Ying Cho! Why is everybody dying? Bidding, get out here. Okay. These women are badass. They are kicking my ass. Okay. Just need to charge your freaking. There we go. Going in. Heal me up. Heal me up. Okay. Get out of here. Run around. Run around. Bring Xingqiu out here. Oh, that might have been a mistake. That's okay. Oh, I've like never heard her voice. Oh, my DPS is out of commission. I can't let Benny die because he is actually the healer. Oh my god. I hate that. Stay still. You can't move around while I'm attacking you. Yeah, I want to investigate right now. I want, I want to see what's in this box right now. Razor, I need you. I gotta wait 15 seconds. Got you. No, you I guess you did. But I got you first. Ha 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 ha. There we go. Nice. Okay, good. Sweet. Oh, okay. It's a precious chest. It feels worth it. Objects like this may prove useful when purging. Who pop up is making you laugh? <laughs> yeah. I feel like. Oh my god. They're just exploding out of everywhere. 
All right, I need to go heal my main. Now I'm at 92. I can't remember if I was at 91 or 92 before. But better than when I started. Yeah, this game also has elemental reactions, which are really neat that I like. Like I can freeze the enemy, I can electrocute the enemy, I can burn the enemy. There he is. Okay, let's see. Oh, there's so many treasure chests. What do you mean down? In the water? In the ground? In the cave? Okay. We'll find it. Hopefully it's in the water. Let's go. Go, 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 go. Okay. And like under the water is literally so freaking beautiful. I love it. Where is it then? I'm gonna scream. Okay, it was like if it's up more. Oh, there it is. This. Okay, sick. All right, how do I pick this up? This game is also a puzzle game if you like puzzle games. I'm not... Here's the thing. I play a lot of puzzle games, I feel, but I'm not, like, actively, uh... Oh, okay, now I gotta get closer. I'm not, like, actively enjoying puzzle games, but I play a lot of them. Like, I loved Catherine, puzzle game. Oh, okay, I just gotta swim next to it. I can do that. Please leave me alone. Oh, can I grab both? Who are you? How dare you? And this one's just vibing, but I have to kill it because it's in the way. Ugh, <laughs> oh, okay. Investigate. Give me all the things. Okay, so... Why do I feel like I have the wrong one? I don't. Okay. Uh, it'd be really cool if I could figure out these puzzles. There we go. Got it. Okay, so we got one of them. Let's try this again. Go. Usually there is four. I just gotta find the fourth one. Nope. I had to get that other thing. Yeah, I definitely feel like I, I like puzzle games in theory, but not... An actual practice. <laughs> I don't like anything that's difficult. You know, like, life's difficult enough. I'm not looking for extra stuff. Fernando says, Okay, so since you mentioned Final Fantasy VII, what game should I start with in remakes? And are the remakes done? Or are you wanting for more? So there's definitely... Part 3 has been confirmed. So right now, Parts 1 and 2 are out. As well as Integrade. Which is like a little mini- I'm gonna say it's not mini, like a mini game, but it's like kind of a, a tiny side story of one of the characters. Where the heck is the last one? What? Oh. Is that it? I can't tell. Hold on. I don't have the thing. Damn it. Okay, so... Here's the thing. So before um, Final Fantasy VII, like the remake came out, I had my husband sit down with me and we played through the entire like OG Final Fantasy 7 and we like had a blast. The game was like a huge part of my childhood and so I was like you should definitely experience this you know before you play the main like the remake so that you can actually like appreciate it even more if that makes sense. And so he did, and he's like, oh, I feel like it was really good that I, like, played the OG first. But if you don't have the time or energy to play the OG, you can just literally watch somebody. Like, there are people who have made little video recaps of the OG game. But I definitely consider you do that. And I think definitely start with Remake, which is the first, then play Integrade, then do Rebirth. That's the order, I think. That you should play it in. But I think it's very good. There's a lot of people who, for some reason, don't like it. I don't understand. But I, like, I played Final Fantasy VII when I was young, so it's always going to have a special place, like, in my heart. So I definitely am biased. 
I feel like all the games that I played in my youth, like Final Fantasy 7, Final Fantasy 9, Final Fantasy 10, I did not like Final Fantasy 8, so I'm not including it in my list. And then it's like the Persona games, like all games that I played in like high school and college. I'm like, they're just special. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I will always like them. But I think it's quite good. Yeah, I wasn't into 14 or 15 or 13. Like I stopped liking them straight up after 10. Like after Final Fantasy 10, I was like, nah, these, these just hit different and I'm not into it like at all. So I'm excited that Final Fantasy 7 got a remake. I got totally freaking trolled. Somebody uploaded on YouTube this actually like beautifully done like Final Fantasy 9 remake announcement and I was like, "Oh my god, finally Final Fantasy 9, my favorite is is getting a remake." And then it was not real. Like somebody just did an absolutely amazing job. Oh, we should play Puzzle Fighter via the Capcom Fighting Game Collection. Oh, the Capcom has a puzzle game? Hell yeah. Yeah, I'd be on to play that well. Okay, let's see. I also just am picking up stuff. There is a treasure chest somewhere. Where? Up more? Okay. Am I still in the area? No, I'm- what the heck? I moved so far. I was like over here. Okay, well this is 75, so we'll just do this one. Ah. I just did a- uh, I had pre-ordered Persona 3 Reload. And I did, I pre-ordered it from Japan and it came with like this little survey thing that I did. And then it was like, what Atlas game do you want to have like remade? And I put Persona 1 and 2 because I'm like, please. And then they gave me a wallpaper like for my phone and it was really nice looking. Very surprised. Okay. Okay, there's only five enemies. We are very much so in the grass. Oh my god. Oh, I can't see. There's so many. It is pretty cool. I was excited. Oh my god. Oh my god. Where are you? Rain outlines your face. I feel like the majority of the time you just playing games is me being like, where are you? What's going on? I don't know if it's because my glasses or what, but when all the shiny stuff is happening on the screen, I literally can't see. Okay, where's my treasure chest? Yay! Ugh, so good. Huh? Good for storage. What is this? Enter? Enter. 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 Oh, we're really going to space with this one, huh? Oh, sick! Hell yeah! What? What? Oh, okay, there it is. I was like, why did it just drop me there? Okay, we love that. I also just like Genshin Impact because it's very beautiful. What? What is the point of this? Is there a puzzle? It has to be a puzzle. It's a puzzle piece, right? Bring me here, I just jump off the side of the building. Okay, we'll never know. That's okay. Seventy-seven. Nice. Okay, we're making good progress. I did not enjoy the desert. I only one hundred percent of this area. Oh, we're getting there though. You played Reload with the Xbox Game Pass. That's cool. I had. I think there was like a PlayStation version of like the Game Pass, and I had played that, but. I only ended up, I think I got, I'm thinking, whatever I had, I got it just to play Katamari, like, forever. And then I played it and I beat it and then I just, like, canceled it. And then, because I realized that for me personally, having, like, unlimited access to a bunch of games is like, nah, I can't do it. I'm too overwhelmed. And then they came out with that new, uh, I already forget what it's called, but, like, the new Katamari game. And I got that on the uh, Switch and the PlayStation. I bought it on the PlayStation at first, not realizing that it was going to just be in 100% Korean. So, then I bought it on the Switch so that I could play it English as well. I mean, it's definitely it's like Animal Crossing. Like, I'll play it in Korean sometimes because you can't, you can't really mess up in those games. Not the way that you could mess up in, like, Persona. So I'm like, okay, I feel like they're safe to try. 
Does the Xbox, like, does the Game Pass have, like, a lot of games? I'm always, I, like, I never had an Xbox. I have no hate against Xbox or anything. I just never, my family was always, like, a PlayStation family. And by my family, I mean me, because my parents didn't really play video games. Like, my mom would play sometimes. She was really into Spiral the Dragon. But she didn't like that time would pass really fast <laughs> while playing a game. Has a lot of games, you either? I see, I see. Ah! Oh my god! I need... What is that? Oh, it's a turtle. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> well, I think I can play Reload myself. <laughs> that. Oh, you get it for the PC. Okay, okay. Well, I don't like that that thing didn't attack me yet. I just gotta just... I always feel bad when the robots are just minding their own business and I'm like, goodbye! Like, I feel bad. Like, they were just literally vibing. Just enjoying the moonlight. Who am I to come over here and destroy them? Oh my god. Okay. I just want all the primal gems. Oh my god. I didn't get a character that I wanted, so now I'm like, I have to do everything I can to get this character that I want. Yeah, fun fun fact, my friend had told me about this game, Genshin Impact, and for some reason I was like, oh, that sounds like a samurai fighting game. I don't know why I thought that, but I did, and I was like, no thanks. And then, like, time went on, and then eventually I was just on the PlayStation Store by myself, and I saw this game, and I was like, wow, this looks, like, really cool. I, I love, like, the art. Like, it looks fun. And then I was like, what's this called? And it was like, Genshin Impact, and I was like, Oh, this is Genshin Impact? Oh my gosh. And so then I played it. <laughs> okay, I marked this on my map because I couldn't figure out this puzzle. So we're going to try again. We're going to try again. Third time's the charm, right? Isn't that what they like say? Isn't that the expression? Swift and merciful. Oh, Shinjo. Okay. Robots are too hard. Okay. I want something fast. Alright, so. Oh, what? Okay. We'll figure this out. What does this mean? How am I supposed to turn this? Huh, okay. I love puzzles! Can I pick up them all? Okay. Oh, I bet those go over here with the arrow. Okay, sick. What does this mean? Oh my god, I figured it out. It just takes some time. No, no, no. Ah! Back it up. Is it... Is it hitting it? I can't tell. We're gonna say it's hitting it. We're gonna say that it's working. <laughs> We're gonna figure it out. Okay. Those are a bunch of bombs. We don't want to blow those up. But I feel like I'm supposed to blow them up. Okay. Let me get... Archer out here. To blow it up. Should I just change my party completely? Where's my... Where's my child party? Where are you? Oh my god, did I not save that party? Why would I do that to myself? Oh my god. What even is this party? Hold on. I'm not organized. This is the same party, but twice. Okay, we're gonna remake this. Which? Okay, child. Come on. Don't keep me waiting. And... What do they do this time? Why are you so negative, baby girl? They didn't do anything bad. Okay. Just sharpen my spear. Nice. Where's Nahida? Okay. And then I didn't deploy it. Because that would make sense. I always do that. Okay. Deploy. Yeah, this game also just has like a lot of characters too, which I like. Some of the characters I think are really good, and some of them I absolutely can't stand. And my game froze. Like it always does. You've heard a lot of bad things about Genshin? Ooh. 
Okay, mainly the gotcha portion of it and the Toxic League players telling me not to play anything other than League. What's- I didn't even know Genjin had a League. But so far it feels like a side quest sim. Yeah, I think it's really, really good. Like, I like it. But here's the thing. I don't ever really talk to anybody besides the people that come into my stream and talk about it. And usually it, it appears that the people who come into my stream are very, like, funny and nice. And nobody's, like, yelled at me. Like, I was expecting to get yelled at because I pretty much only play with five stars. Like, I'm not out here playing with, like, the characters we're supposed to be playing with. Because I'm like, whatever. I like who I like. That's what matters. Oh my god, I did it! Uh, amazing. Big brain. Oh, League of Legends. I don't know why I read that wrong. Sorry. <laughs> I was like, Genshin has a league? Wow! Yeah, I never played League of Legends. I don't know anything about it. I'm like reading your com your comment again. Yeah, here's the thing. Like, I think the gotcha... I've played other games, though, that I thought had a worse gotcha system. Like, there was one game that I played, and I was literally so mad, because in Genshin, like, your pity rolls over. So if you don't get the character that you want, you can get them later. Like, you can try again later. Or you can, like, use... We'll play as Zhao. Like, uh, let's say I wanted this character, a Nouvellet, and I roll and I roll and I roll and I don't get him. Like, I'm guaranteed one five star he's a five star every 90 rolls so if i roll 90 time i would get a five star but maybe it's not him then it's like you're guaranteed i'm doing a very bad job of explaining this i don't fully understand it but like if i don't get him and then i go roll on like this banner or him again it will take up to 90 times for him to be guaranteed but sometimes it happens really fast, sometimes it happens really slowly. Like, I got this character when I rolled for him the previous time he was available, like in 20 tries. Like, sometimes you just get them really fast. Like, this character right here who I'm running around with right now, I got him after literally 10 tries. So, but then there's other characters that I tried, I didn't get them at all. Like, the character that I'm saving up for right now, like, I just didn't get him, so now I have to wait, you know? A team of babies is <laughs> our league. Her team of babies. Yeah, hell yeah. Like, I wanted this guy really bad. He is really, really powerful and strong. And I didn't get him, so now I'm saving up. But I feel like because I'm not, like... I know there's a lot of people who really want characters. But for me personally, I'm like, I get overwhelmed. Like, these are all the characters I have. And, like, I'm straight up overwhelmed. I can't, I can't use and build all... All of these characters so I feel like if you're gonna play the game just um, don't roll don't do what I did when I first started don't roll for everybody and like if you get somebody that you don't like their playstyle and you're not like 100 invested in using don't build them just because they're considered like a good character like D Luke is considered really good so I started to build him and then I'm like I don't like his playstyle I'm not gonna use D Luke I really enjoy Razor instead so let's put our effort into that so I think it just, like, the gotcha is not too big of a deal, as long as you don't, you know, get too obsessed with, like, collecting them all. Like, there's so many characters in this list that I'm like, I don't even want this character. Like, I wish I could give it to somebody that, like, wants it. Like, there's so many, so many people that I'm like, I want them out of here. I have, like, my, my favorite ten. That's all I want. League is disgusting. Not my words. I play it too often. <laughs> And I played the worst gacha game of them all, Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Link, and paid over 200 USD during the pandemic. Whoa! I didn't even know Yu-Gi-Oh! Had a, had a gacha game. Actually, I think I didn't know that. I think one of my friends is playing that, maybe. I got a friend that I met in Korea that, like, really, really likes Yu-Gi-Oh! And I went into, like, a, a gaming event, and there was, like, a Yu-Gi-Oh! stand. And I was like, oh, hey, do you want merch? And she was like, yeah. So I waited in line, except then I realized I was in the wrong line, and I had accidentally gotten into the line for, like, actually dueling. And so I had to like get out of the line really fast because so I'm like, oh no, I don't even have a deck. I can't be in this line. I can't be dueling. Because uh, it was really hard to tell like what the line was for. There was like two lines. So I'm like, this is probably the line for the store. And then it wasn't. So, But thankfully I escaped. Yeah, there was a gacha game that I played and like the pity didn't roll over. So like if I lost a character the next time that it was like time, I just was like... SOL like it was like you weren't you weren't getting it like that's just it's just that was it you lost it 
you have to try again later. And so I stopped playing because I was like, that's not fun. Like, it d felt like they weren't really helping the characters. Or if you if you didn't, like, at least with Genshin, if you miss that character's banner, there's always a chance for, like, later. But the game that I was playing, like, once they were gone, they were gone. And if you wanted to get them again, you pretty much had to spend real money. And I was like, I don't like that either. So no thanks. Oh, sick! Easiest treasure chest ever. Dragon Ball Legends in DBZ Dokken Battle for me. I don't even want to think about how much I've spent. Ugh. Oh, I love being free to play. I get, like, satisfaction from knowing that they didn't get a single cent from me. That's, like, how I keep going. Where is that stupid ball? Oh my god, I'm losing my mind. There was a ball. Hold on, let me go really far away and then turn around. There was a ball. I am... What the heck? Did I blow up the ball? I'm so confused. Whatever. Okay. <coughs> I'm re Oh, Keith? Keith! Ugh. <laughs> uh. I mean, to each to each their own. Like, if you guys are pay paying money and you're having a good time, like, that's what matters. You know? I know somebody who plays Genshin that has spent literally thousands. And I'm like, I can't do that. But if I had the money, maybe I would. Okay, let's see. I'm losing my mind. There was a ball. And I was supposed to do something with it. Okay, well, whatever. It's gone now. So... <laughs> Maybe I solved the puzzle and I just didn't realize it. Oh, that's the problem. You're not having a good time. No. No, Fernando. I'm so sorry to hear that. Ah. Oh. Yeah, I had to actually just straight up uninstall the game that I'm talking about. Because I was having a bad time and I was like, I refuse to pay any money. And I was just getting like too mad. It was like a, a visual novel game on my phone. And I was like, no. I'm pissed can't play this anymore okay there's still supposed to be treasure chests why is it really blue all of a sudden okay let's see no no stay down okay i want to see something i'm going to check i'll just leave zhao in the middle of the ocean like there's so many characters that i want to level up and then i'm like i want to start collecting four Risley. But I don't need everything. I just want to start, you know. Risley's level up materials. There we go. It's called Ascension. Oh, and then there's also like friendship points. Where, where where's the thing? This. And then you can like um change your avatar like he's my favorite character so he's my avatar picture but like you can have one of all the different characters and there's like name cards too like i think this name card is the prettiest but like you can change them to whatever other things you have which is fun and then you can even put like um edit profile you can put like the characters you have that you like which is cool name cards for display i just really like this game what do I need for Risley? Get a Jade Chunk, whatever that means. Oh my god. I need so much stuff. Ah. Usually they'll tell you like the, the end amount, but I need a lot of like this one stupid beetle. So I don't know if I'm going to do that. Ugh. You stopped playing online games in the last six months, except League, because I don't enjoy them nearly as much anymore. In addition to that, my... Wait, 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 I can't read. In addition to that, my girlfriend's PC stopped working as well, so we're saving for that. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry to hear the PC stopped working. That sucks. <laughs> Dong Yo, I thought Fate Grand Order had the worst gotcha system. Was so wrong. I feel like all of us have been burned from different gotcha systems. Okay, we'll go over here. I, like, never come up here. Ugh. Yeah, I feel like Genshin was actually, like, the 
first gacha game that I think I ever played that I like remember playing was a gacha game. Okay, let's see. I love these like big cubes just in the sky. Like they look so freaking good. I want to see something really quick. What is in my pocket? It is something. Okay. Every time I see this, I think it's something else. I'm like, I have so many. And it's like, no, you actually don't. Oh, sick. Wait, I have 62. I know that I just got over here, but I'm going to move immediately. Yeah, I tried to play Fate Grand Order and I also had a hard time. I realized too that I think, like after that one gacha game that I played and then I stopped, I was like, I don't think that I am a mobile game player. I have terrible eyesight. The screen's too small. And my phone battery's dying. Like, I'm definitely, like, a console PC player. Rewards. I'm about to get two of them. Hell yeah. Let's see what we got. <clears throat> Amazing. I'm at level 32 out of 50. We're getting somewhere. The real losers are the FIFA NBA 2K players that pay every year to upgrade their characters just for a new game to come out that next year. What the heck? That sounds awful. Like, no offense, but like, why? Why? That sounds bad. Sounds not good. Um, there's gotta be... Okay, whenever there's no treasure coming up in the treasure compass, I'm like, it's gotta be something else then. Oh, this place is big though, so no wonder. Let's try over here. Ah, oh, ooh, pretty tree. Okay. No, still nothing. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, I was like, what a pretty house, and it's like, oh wait, no, the house has <laughs> totally been burned down. Not a pretty house. Let's see what I need. Oh, earlier you were talking about- I know that you didn't mean The Sims when you said, like, um, uh, side quest sim. There's, like, something called a teapot in this game, and you can kind of decorate it and have, like, a grand old time, and it's quite cute. I will show my teapot in a second. What do I need? This? This. Oh, I have a bunch! I'm fine. Okay. Let's go to my teapot. I can actually get quick primos in my teapot, so it works out for me. Yeah, they spend in the hundreds in game on top of a $70 purchase of that game each year. That sounds wild. I used to play, like, on the PlayStation 1 when I was a literal little itty bitty baby. I played the soccer game. FIFA, FIFA, FUFA, whatever it's called. And I always forget, and people always tell me, and I always forget. Like, it was fun, but I can't imagine, like, paying that much money. But like I said, if they're happy, that's what matters. Let's see. This realm is truly beginning to thrive. Is it? I cannot help but be stirred. She is literally so cute. Like, okay. Can I buy anything? Okay. Because you can, like, make furniture and, like, decorate. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make some furniture. <laughs> um... Oh my gosh, okay, I have a Fallout, a little, a little Fallout story. I did play Fallout, and I actually really liked it. So, when I was in high school, I was in band, and I got into, like, a, a little bit of a disagreement, an argument, if you will, it's a small argument, with, um, another kid in band, because I was like, Final Fantasy is the best game series, and he's like, no, it's Fallout. And then we were arguing, and I was like, you know what, this isn't fair. Like, I never even played Fallout, and you never played Final Fantasy. So how, how are we able to say that what we like is better than the other one if we've never played like that doesn't make any sense and he was like yeah that, that makes sense okay so we agreed that we would um bring each other because we both had playstation 3s at the time i was like i'll bring you no i think he had a... i brought him final fantasy 10 so he must have had a playstation 2 as well because he brought me fallout for the playstation 3 and i bought him final fantasy 10 for the playstation 2 and we played them and he ended up actually really liking 
he really, really liked it. And then I really liked Fallout. But at one point I had to call him because I was like, hey, my character's like running really slowly. And he's like, what's in your pockets? And I was like, uh, and then I, I was reading him what was in my pockets and it was like, cup, 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 cup. And he's like, why? Why did you pick up all the cups? What are you doing? And I was like, well, in my defense, in Final Fantasy, you can only pick it up if you need it. So I assumed that because I could pick it up, I needed it. And he was like, no, that's not how it works. And I was like, well, you live and you learn. I'm having a problem. I... I set my phone to black and white so that I could study. Oh, here we go. And I was like, and now I don't know how to turn it off. But I figured it out. We're in color again. Thank God. Okay, I want to... See how these, like, there's, like, characters? Like, there's the image of the place, and then in the bottom right corner there's characters. And they have check marks on them. I'm trying to build furniture sets who have characters that I actually have because like the three characters that they have I don't have them I want to do that ancient branch shrine okay so that's definitely not here ancient branch shrine oh my god I need a lot okay oh let's see but yeah I definitely would be interested in playing Fallout again I don't know if I'd stream it because like same with Final Fantasy 7 I really like it but it was quite hard to stream in my opinion but I definitely would be interested in, like, playing it again. It was quite good. Quite fun. <laughs> definitely a fallout moment with the cubs. Yeah, that was literally, like, the first time I had ever played a game where you could just pick anything up, whether you needed it or not. And I remember I was so, like, what? What? Like, when my friend was telling me that, I was like, oh, my God. I didn't even know. I didn't even know that I didn't need it. I thought I had to have it. Okay, cleansing grind. Burn filter. What 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 don't I have? Okay, I need eight of this. Well, good for me. I have five hundred and twelve. You recommend New Vegas, but I might enjoy Fallout Four since the graphics are better. I will look it up. I think I played three. Whatever one was for the PlayStation Three is what I played. Okay, and then I need this. Um, oh, I have 400. Hell yeah. We'll just make 50. Why not? 50 pieces of wood sounds good. Oh, wait, no. Doesn't sound good. Leave. Hold on. How many do I need? I realize that the limit is 50. And it's like, I don't want that. Wait, they took it away. Oh my god. I'll just find it myself. I'm about to be like, never mind, because it's like hard. Oh, it's going to be red. Like, not red, it's going to be grayed out. Here. Oh my god, I only need one piece? Hell yeah. Confirm. Convert. Ye. Okay. Find it again. Hopefully it'll be at the top. Cleansing Shrine. I thought the storyline in Fallout was pretty good. I have a question. Is Fallout like Final Fantasy where like you don't need to play like 7 to understand 10? Or is it like a you have to play all to understand the story? That is my question for you. Enzing Shrine. Okay. There are two for the PlayStation 3. Okay, I didn't play New Vegas. I definitely would have played 3. Oh my god, I spelled it wrong. Cleansing. I know how to spell. Okay. Alright, perfect. We got that. We got that. Of this weird looking rock. What? Is that an item or. Okay, hold on. I need. White. Fish hello candle. Oh my god, I'm not even typing. Ugh. I do that all the time where I'm like not actually typing when I'm supposed to be. I never learned how to type well, so I just have to like look at the keyboard the whole time. There it is. And then I need three of them. One, two, 
Wait, how many did I already have? Okay, good. I only need two. Sick. Foundation of Stone Double Time. I actually really enjoy like this part of the game. I'm sure a lot of people don't, but I like I like the uh, teapot. Foundations of Stone. Let's go. There's so many with the actual head. Two of Double time? Double time, okay. Well, luckily for me, I have like a, so, so many of the rocks. Okay. How many fallouts are there now? Okay, I don't have to play the others at all, but there are references to the other games within them, and there is a general storyline that they all kind of start from. They all have their own stories. I get that. So, like, it would be interesting if I played them all, but, like, not, uh, not necessary. Now I need... No. Fortune slip stand. I'm actually really freaking excited for my Persona stream this weekend because uh, I'm going to Kyoto on the school trip. So I'm actually really excited. I've never been to Kyoto, so I'm excited to live vicariously through these kids. Twelve. Okay, let's see. Ah. Uh, oh, I have a thousand of this? Oh my god. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Confirm. Convert. Yep. Why did they limit us to only 50 times? It feels unnecessary. Like, wh why? Because I don't super remember the school trip either. Like, I remember a few things. I remember the big thing with the bathhouse, but I don't remember, like, anything else from the trip, so, like, I'm really excited. Oh my god! <sighs> what is with this? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Everything from this continent needs so much. Twelve? I'm gonna literally lose my mind if I <laughs> run out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, go, 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 go. Convert. Eek. Only have 25 times left. Okay, we got that. The statue. I wonder, like, how many other people are taking advantage of this, like, primogem farming. Maybe I shouldn't say farming, because once you do it, it's done. Like, you can't do it again. But I still think it's a good way to make money. No, like the first two, kind of like Persona Law, are very- Ah, okay, very outdated. So Fallout 1 and 2 are just not- Not it anymore. But they still saw the games. Fallout 3 and New Vegas, my absolute favorite game of all time, are ugly, unfortunately. But here's the thing, I actually really like, like, the ugly old school graphics. Like, as much as I love new graphics, I just love the ugly old ones. And especially since I played Fallout 3, like, whenever I do finally eventually play, I'm sure I'll be like- Really excited about it. Like, excited about those graphics. Be like, wow! I remember, though, that I get scared, like, really, really easily. And I remember that quite a few times I got really scared when I was playing Fallout. Okay. Street link. The story slap. And Fallout 4 is good, but nothing to write home about? Okay. Well, what, why is it called, um, New Vegas? Is it because they're there? Like, what? why is it called that? And then there is Fallout 76. It is an online game that I haven't played at all yet, but I'm not so keen on playing it. Yeah. I'm like, not to sound rude, but like, if it involves playing with other people that I don't know, I'm like, nah, I'm good. No thanks. Eight pieces of this wood? Where's this wood even from? Oh my god. No, not that one. We want this one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. 
I played games online. I don't even remember the game. I had like a game that was about like a teddy bear, like a real like l like human sized teddy bear. And you had to like go and kill other teddy bears or something. I do not remember why, but I had that game and you could play it online with other people. And that was like, I think the only time I ever played online with other people. And the people were like so mean that I was like, I'm never doing this again. And then I have it. I only play online with people that I know because the internet is a scary place. Ugh. I love the yes, exactly. Okay, I don't have any space to put any more furniture. Let's try and shove it on this place. Hopefully it fits. Okay. I just want... I guess it's not really money, but I'm like, I just want... I just want more Primos. What? I should have everything! Oh, I didn't... I didn't claim it, did I? Yeah, I didn't claim it. I always do that. Ugh. I am the forgetfulness master. Okay, let's go back. Well, at least I don't have to walk. That's at least good for me. <laughs> and you can even place animals like in this teapot. Like, it's sick. I actually really like this. Beginning to thrive. Is it? Is it? I'm confused. Hold on. Why is it saying that I don't have that thing that I definitely have? There. Oh, I think that I made all the stuff and then I didn't make it. Well, no matter what, I don't have it and that's what matters. You know. Oh, I need two. Probably only made one. Okay, we'll just do this. Oh, uh, wah. I need... No. This? Okay. I have one. I have one? I need two! Okay. I'm so good at this. So, so amazing at remembering all the things that I need to know. Okay. I'm literally so desperate to get this character. Like, it's not even funny. I'm like, I will literally do whatever. Whatever I have to do. I still need to try to beat, like, the Spiral Abyss, but it's hard. New Vegas is based in Las Vegas after the nuclear fallout, and it just has the best writing in all of the franchise, and it's not even made by the same company, just same... Engine is three. Oh, how did another company like how are they able to do that? I'm actually quite interested. Like, how did they how? Ooh. No no no. This one. Okay, okay. Give me my street lamp. Okay. Goodbye. Tubby. Thank you. I'm like confused now. <laughs> I just want... Oh, I did it. Hell yeah. Place! Okay. The smallest number. Place! Okay, hell yeah. Nice! There is not enough space for this. Let's try like this. I don't like that they're so close. But at the same time, it doesn't really matter. Can we rotate just a little bit? Okay. A little bit so that it's not like ridiculously all up in the fountain space. Okay. I'm not really going for looking good though. I'm going for getting my primos. Okay, so now we need to... Oh, we're on the CD? Okay, that's fine. We need to get rid of two people so that we can bring two people back. Because right now the people who I built that for are not here. Oh my god, Zhao, I'm sorry! There we go, saved it. I was like, whew. And I have to wait. Yeek. Okay. This looks quite pretty though. I like it. The main company gave them a contract to make the game and only gave them a year and three months from start to finish. That feels too, too short. The company that made New Vegas was the original creators of Fallout. Oh! 
Thank you for explaining that. That is actually quite interesting. I'm actually- I'm surprised. Okay, can I use the CD now? Okay, sick. Um... Like, who can I get rid of that I'll remember? Right, Sino, get out. Nahida, get out. And then... Here, okay. And let's put right in and yeah, Miko. Okay, Miko is friendship level one. Okay, there we go. And where is right in? I never thought the day would come when I would put down right in Shogun and the Miko in my teapot of my own free will. What do you mean? Oh my god. I hate that when it's like you can't put her down. There's no space. It's like, okay, I'll just put her behind this uh, gate. <laughs> Put her wherever she needs to be. Jeez. Okay. Where are you? I want my present. Yay. My, someone rather discerning fitted out this shrine. Nothing looks out of place and everything spaced out just right. Is it? I think it's a mess, but yes, thanks. I have to hand it to you. You can be rather considerate when it counts. I love her design so much, but I do not like her. Invite. Oh, where where are you, Rin? Girl, where are you at? Okay, there we go. Why are you so far away? Okay. This shrine looks somewhat familiar. It should. Is this what it means to reminisce? Hmm. So be it. The sensation is not a disagreeable one. I'm glad you like it. Twenty primos, thanks. <laughs> That's the fee. All right. Ah, uh, light novel. She owns like a, a publishing company. And immediately, get out. Okay. And where is, right in. Get out. Okay. Now we get to put down the actual characters that I like. Nahida, who's almost level ten, and then I can put somebody else down. And where'd Sino go? Five. Okay. Hold and leave. Amazing. Saving my changes. I wish that I got primos from this. I understand why we don't, but it's still hard. Because there's like, there's a list of achievements, and one of the achievements is like, craft a certain amount of furniture. And I'm like, I really want that. I think it's this one. Oh my god, I'm so close. 525 and I just need 600? Okay. I'll make a couple more sets later. Going back to Final Fantasy VII, they have it on Steam, the OG version. Should I wait till I get the Steam Deck or do I get it now and play it right away? When are you going to get the Steam Deck? Like how much time until you get the Steam Deck? Because if it's like anytime soon, I'd say wait, but if it's going to be a long time, I would just say get it and play it now. If you buy it now, can you play it on Steam Deck later? That's my other question. Because I don't understand how that works very well. Ugh. That doesn't even look neat. That just looks the scary. Will sooner die again Next six months? I think I would just buy it and play it now if you have no other games that you're like super interested in. Because... And maybe it's just because I, I play games kind of slowly, but I think it's going to take a long time to, like, defeat it, you know? Oh, you just started playing Persona 4 Golden again? <laughs> oh, are you somebody that can play, like, two games at once? Like, I have a really hard time, like, playing, like, two games at the same time. Like, earlier I kept pressing the wrong buttons because I'm like... Oh, this is this is the run button and it's like no that's the run button in Final Fantasy 7 that is not the run button in Genshin Impact I'm trying to like do this request so that's like why the screen is paused I get like, nope then, <laughs> then if you I mean if you truly want to play Persona 4 or Golden again and, and you're gonna like do start to finish then I say wait but if you're like kind of just playing it because you have like no other games to play then I definitely say get Final Fantasy 7 Oh, they're the Electro Sealy. I hate those. Uh, ugh. 
Nar Narukami Island. Oh my god, that's hard. Oh! It's like too spread out. Okay. But we'll just try. Oh yeah, definitely wait till it's on sale. I think that's a good plan. I have mail. Yay, I got some rocks in the mail. We love rocks. Okay. Are you okay, Zhao? Jeez. Those memories. It scared me. It's so dark. Yeah, it sounds like it. I have a feeling I got this one, but we're gonna just gonna try it. I did that with some games. Like, there was a game series that I wanted to play, like Nino Kuni, and like the second one for some reason was on sale, so I bought the second one, and then I waited like a really long time, and then the first one went on sale, and then I bought the first one. Because <laughs> I'm like, I definitely want to get this when it's on sale. Oh yeah, I just realized there's not a steely compass. Where am I? Okay, it's supposed to be over here. I think I got this one. It's supposed to be by a large rock pile. Whatever that means. I think I got it though. Yeah. Okay. Or is that it? Or is that just a rock? I don't know. You did the same thing with Yakuza? Yeah, I feel like I, I don't- I just don't enjoy paying full price. Like, Persona 3 reload and then final fantasy 7 rebirth for like two of the games that i've paid full price for in like a very long time nope that's a fake mint there's no sparkles and see how it's a little text box it's fake this one is also fake oh my god i was like this one's real but it's not real it's fake see because like this one is like an item i can pick up and see how it's sparkly and it has a picture of it okay, let's see where is the next one? Over there? Okay. I'm literally so, like, obsessed with getting enough primos to get this character. Because there's, there's also other characters that I want. So it's hard. Being free to play is hard when everybody you want is all dropped at the same freaking time. Okay. The other hard thing is that... I might have just also gotten this already. No! Okay. Oh. Ooh, I'll pick that up. Been a long time since I ran around Inazuma, but I also just really, really want- Wow! Look how beautiful that looks! Oh my god. Let's get in camera mode. Hi, character. Like, look how nice! Beautiful. I'm actually straight up gonna take a photo. Like, that looks really nice. Ugh! I love this game. It's so pretty. Okay, in a few minutes, I'm gonna wrap it up. Because it's, it's a holiday, so I have, like... Well, it's not really a holiday. It's a voting day. So, I don't have class. And, and most people got off of work. And so, it's just a good old time. I have things that I plan to do today since I'm not working no, my sword. <laughs> I'm not going to class Witness the power of Gugwa. Disappear. Disappear. let's Worthless. go I can't even see where he Worthless. is I'm just gonna keep jumping Fall me. Oh, their voices are so freaking creepy I don't even know if I need to be over here but I hate Worthless. that I can't like ex like can't look at anything unless I defeat them. Okay, no, that's just ambush one and phase two, phase three. Okay, that's fine. What is this? This looks not like what I thought it was. Okay. Darn, it's not what I needed. Uh, hopefully one day I can find them. This one says it's underground, which is also not helping. Oh my god, it's just a humongous scorpion. Big no thanks. I'm gonna go this way. Uh, okay. 
let's see. I think I got all the ones there. The hard part is that it says that I need to get like two more, but I, I've already 100%ed. So I'm like, didn't I already get them? But I guess I didn't. I also didn't particularly like them, so I wouldn't be surprised if I saw them and was like, no, I'm good. Ooh. No. Is that it? No. Okay. That's one of the ones that I already did. One day. One day I will find what I'm looking for. At least I can appreciate how beautiful the game is. Hmm. Wait, do I have a key? Do I have a Shrine of the Depths key? I don't? Oh, I really thought that I did. Uh, okay. Never mind. You're gonna hop off? Did you go out to wake up extra early tomorrow? And your boss isn't the happiest? Aw. Ooh, I've been there. Good luck, man. I understand how that is. I mean, hey, at least it wasn't a thousand, am I right? <laughs> but I understand. I hope that you sleep well and have a good day tomorrow. <laughs> oh. oh my god, there's a treasure chest. What? If it's useful, this wasn't even what I needed. Okay. Hello, child. Wait a minute, Paimon. Guess what you're... Like, Paimon, guess what you're about to say? Paimon needs them urgently. Boo-hoo. Oh my god. Bye bye. Oh, still hasn't found his mom. We'll do our best. Is this a quest? Did I just start Let's something? What? Why? Why are you stopping this kid from finding his mom? I got beef with any adult who's trying to mess with a kid. Idiot. Yeah, get him, Chong Yun. Is there more? What the heck was that about? Okay, well, on that random note, I'm also gonna I'm gonna call it done for the day. But thank you for watching, thank you for chatting, and I will see everybody this weekend when I stream Persona 3 Reload. Bye!